Hey everybody, I just wanted to take a moment to tell you all about our newly relaunched Patreon page and all of the exclusive rewards that you can get by signing up. We've relaunched the TBG Live channel that you're watching right now where we upload our full Twitch replays and we've also made the decision to completely remove all mid-video ads from this channel for future videos. As well as that, I'm also gonna be adding timestamps into the description, which is gonna allow you to quickly skip to the start of matches if you want to skip the fluff. If you wanna help support this channel, then Patreon is a great way to do that and you'll get early access to watch these videos as well as a ton of other great perks. You can view all of the info over on patreon.com slash thebeardguys and from the price of just one Twitch sub, you can help support the channel and get yourself some great rewards. Thanks very much for listening. I'll leave you to enjoy the video and I'll see you next time. Uh, so you wanted a quick look at my guns that I've still got to do. So it's most of them, really. I think it's probably easier to remember the ones I've done. And then I know what not to use, basically. Um, so there's, these are my guns. And they're my various mastery levels at the moment. So ones I've got to 100 already. We just started doing this on Monday, basically. I hadn't really pushed for any mastery for a long time. I've just been using whatever and using the stuff I like. But we're going to try and level up a bunch of stuff that I don't normally use now. So. Um, at level 100, we have SLR, SKS, SCAR, MK14, Mini, Uzi, M4, M24, K9, Barrel, Orm, and the AKM. That's all my level 100s. Everything else needs a bit of leveling. Some stuff is really close. The MP5, Groza, Pumpy, QBZ, they're all 98, 99. G36, we should try and get done, shouldn't we? Because that's, um, Vikendi's going to go in the update. So we should try and get that done. MP5 will be available on Karakin, so that's not too much of an issue. But yeah, G3. I mean, not that, like, by the time I've done all of these guns, I'm sure Kar I'm sure Vikendi will have come back in rotation again. But, um, but yeah, so we basically, I want to just try and use anything off this list that isn't a 100 is kind of the, kind of the deal. Like we did on Monday, it went, um, you know, and it worked great. It was good fun. It was just nice to play the game a bit different, wasn't it? And, you know, just use different stuff. You're the best. That's good. That's good. Battlegrounds Party gives guns that stuff. I don't know if it's kept up to date. Yeah, I've no idea really. Can you recommend any good headsets for gaming? Uh, I like my Astro A50s. They're expensive, but they're great. Astro A40s are also a very popular headset. They're a bit cheaper. How you doing, Tom Hawk? Nice to see you, mate. Got my, my loose paddle. It's going to keep falling off today because my controller's falling apart. My shitty Power A controller. Let's see if we get on with my... Ugh, God, it's going to keep, like, not working. Let's see if my crouching is works today. My HyperX is pretty good. 90 quid or so. Nice. Yeah, I've just had this headset for, like three years or something so i haven't used anything else for a long time bo 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 nice and chilled people seem to be enjoying today's youtube video they always love an update video everybody loves an update video a classic can't go wrong. Quality content. I got your first big win running a decked out G36 with 3X. Oh, it's so much fun for spraying with the 3X, right? So much fun. Hey, Molf, how you doing? Lovely to see ya. I am doing fantastically, thank you. I've never read a PUBG patch notes. You always do it for me. Excellent. Well, that's, that's how I make content. Relying on people, you know, not reading the patch notes. The more people that read the patch notes, the worse it is for YouTubers, right? Because we, we, don't, we can't tell you stuff. Don't you have a Steel Series knocking about? You got given. Yeah, I've got the Steel Series Arctis uh, 7X or is it 9X? 9. I, I can't remember, to be honest. I don't want it. I might hit the fucking billboard here. Ooh. Some sort of wireless. 
um, you know, headset jobby. We're going full titty into here. Push me, bro. Push me. Gun. Gun. Just accidentally picked up that helmet or something. I don't think anyone's coming here. Neither of these are guns I want to use for my <laughs> my quest, but we'll take them at the moment just to stay alive. Stay alive. Let's do M16 because that does need leveling. Somewhat of a tradition. I like doing those videos. They're good fun. You don't really want an AK, but it's not too much of an issue at the minute. Um, okay. Well, there's no other guns here that we we need to level, really, are there? The M24's already done. Try and, try and find some boys. Is there anything I missed over here? I guess the shot he needs doing, but we won't worry about that just at the minute. Let's go for a little trot around so we can find some people. Get warmed up. We haven't shot a gun yet. He's... Are they shooting from roofs or windows? Let's see if we can... Just... Where the fuck am I getting shot from? Oh, they're inside. Sound like they're on the roof. <gasps> M4, M249... God, everyone's got the M249. We're going to take it because it needs leveling. We got an extended for it? Nope. Quick draw, though. I can hear a guy. I don't know if he's down here or on the roof. Where is everybody? There's a guy in this middle roof, maybe? Oh, man down there as well. God, my fingers are a bit, a bit slow this time of the morning. Hmm, I don't really want this fight. Comp on the M16. Oh, where's, where did the comp end up? It's all a blur. Uh, hey, Dark Daddy, how you doing? Like this. Okay, right. M249 is something we need to level. Attack stock. Fresh helmet. This guy. Don't really need any of that. And there's the comp. What's going on? There we go. Alright, I think we're good. What time is it there now? It's ten past one uh, in the afternoon. Right. Have a look round. There was a guy in the garages, the guy on the roof. Don't know who else is left. Keep an eye out. We got the tacky on the M249 is nice. We still need the extended. I just killed you. Oh, GG's. GG's. There's a man in there. I just saw him. He's definitely seen me because he's hiding behind this thing. Kind of gonna. We gonna you just you gonna peek? There we go. Thank you. Tagged him.
<laughs> uh, got him. What's up, Jam? How you doing? No extended, but might might use that. I don't know. Get rid of the eight for now. Uh, was that the guy from the roof? I'm not really sure if it was or not. Take a better bag. How you doing, Dark Dudley? Great to see ya. Oh, there is a man up there. Did you see a man there? Oh no, I think it was this... I saw the top of this lamppost looking a bit suspicious. <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good. I think there's still probably a guy here. At least a guy. We need to find a vehicle, really. The zone's a little way. Um, I mean, these are both... Both definitely guns, um... You know, that we need to level here. It's kind of a... Kind of a wacky loadout. Um, okay. Do that. Bosh, thank you. Have another boost. In fact, let's have this, and then we'll go find a vehicle. Um, we've got attack stock. How you doing, Hoots? Great to see you, mate. Canted. We're fine. We've got plenty of ammo, quite a bit. Dead guy. DMR comp. More ammo. Ooh, don't need the flashy, thank you. A bike could be handy. We got no meds. That's not not ideal. In fact, we've got no meds. Let's let's get out of here. <laughs> That's pretty bad. The circle's not a million miles, but you know, uh, cycling might take a little while. We got one one kill with a useful weapon so far. What we need to focus on today is so leveling up these guns. You get points for I see a bike. Nice. You get points for damage, um, and you get like a bonus for oh that is really handy. You get a bonus for, um, like, the further, longer you last in a game, basically, the further through the game you get, you get an extra bonus. So, um, we need to kind of focus on getting a few kills and getting longer in the game rather than, like, going crazy for kills but then dying early. I think we'll, we'll get more points from lasting a bit longer. Is how I, you know, how I think it works. So, you know, we still want to get some kills, obviously, but... We just need to be, you know, we need to get some longer games as well. Lone Pessimist, thank you so much for the Prime, brand new Prime sub. Thank you very much. Thank you kindly. Could well be someone on the bridge. We did hear some shots off towards the bridge a minute ago. So we need to be a little careful. It might have been on this road. Just, I'm going to try and avoid this just because with no first aids, it makes it pretty rough. Although you do get loads of meds on the bridge, I suppose. We can always find some on the bridge. Have I managed a zero kill chicken dinner yet? Um, I don't know. I mean, I've probably done that before, right? I've de Is that a bike parked up there? No. I'm going to stop here and um, get meds. You know what, at the end? There's a buggy parked up there somewhat suspiciously. That might just be a spawn, though. Lovely meds. Wonderful meds. Got to be careful not to frag everyone as well. If the more people I frag... Dude, in a freaking boat. I'll get the, you know, the more people I frag, the less weapon XP I'll have. It's never going to happen. God, I hate using this gun. Ooh! This guy is going to get through. we got one first aid. Maybe we'll just get out of here. Oh. You've got lit up. I'm not sure we hit him at all when he, he was uh, when we shot the car. We just annihilated his car. I was going for the tires. Take some stuns. There we go. 
Right, uh, there was someone shooting from the end. We need to be cautious of here. Pseudonym, how you doing? Thank you for the 35 months. Cheers, mate. How you doing today? Right, where was this guy who was shooting from the end? That was the guy who I shot before, I think. Ah! Be better cover to shoot from. You're gonna get shot in the ass. Quality Molly. Where's the other guy though? The other guy ran off over here. Where'd you go, punk? You get up there? I don't know where he would have gone. I saw him scampering around down this way. I feel like he would have tried to get over there towards the play zone. I'll keep moving, see if he pops up. Ah, uh, what's up, Stokes? How you doing? Yeah, nice little molly on that guy, wasn't it? Bit scrappy with the shooting, but, you know, we're fine. Oh, you had everything, didn't you? Uh, let's put that on there, get that loaded. Next zone is fine. we got loads of meds now as well, which is great. Boosted. I only installed PUBG at Season 6, as I'm that bad. No matter how much I played it, there was zero improvement. <laughs> is that the last time you played? How long ago was that? What's up, Xbox Traitor? How's it going? I'm good, Stokes. How are you? Aimless Kent, how's it going? Hi from Brazil. What's up, Gu Guerrero? Uh, sorry, Guer Guerrero, I think that is. Um, another tax stock, sure. I'm going to leave the frags because it's less temptation to use them, isn't it? Should we just... Um, I mean, we'll keep the suppressor. I mean, maybe we'll, maybe we'll find a use for it. I don't know where this guy ran off to, but... He gone. He gone. There is another crate in the road, but I think we're good. This will do. It feels like I haven't got as much ammo as I might need, but it's because you have so much loaded into the M249, it just like uses it up, doesn't it? 150 rounds in there. It's good storage space, right? There's a buggy parked up. Hello. You still around? I feel like they might have parked and gone in that compound. People really love that compound. Or is just chilling in a bush, I suppose. Don't see anybody. Hey Nacho, how you doing? How are you, mate? I was very happy to see you were back home. Oh, this guy is a dead guy. What happened here? Was well, a murder. Distant car there. Sure. Okay, we'll go back and get the bike and go go exploring. Hey Vicky, how you doing? Call that video this morning so website there's accurate gun stats that anyone know, knows of. We were talking about that a minute ago. We're not really sure to be honest. Not really sure. Take this one. Thank you very much. Uh, so we're trying to use stuff that I don't. Basically, using guns that I don't often use, using stuff they haven't already level 100 did. 
and just seeing if we can level it up a bit. That's kind of my new goal. It's been good fun. We did it on Monday. Uh, it was it was a good a good laugh. Hence why I've got an M249 and an M16. You know, not two of the harder ones to level up, I would say, but both guns that I don't, you know, that I don't use a bunch. Still worth keeping an eye on crates, even though, you know, we might end up using the guns from them. But, you know, just for the armor is still useful. Let's go get this on the armor. I mean, if we find a crate gun that's lower level, we can take like an MG3, I guess, to be, you know, we need to level. But I don't know if that's worth taking over the M249, really. It's not like it's hard to find an MG3, is it? <laughs> They're everywhere. I mean, the only one we... The problem is, the only ones we we don't need to level are the MK and the Orm. Oh, God, it's hard to leave an MK or an Orm, right? They're such good guns. Hard to resist doing that. Just firing away like mad. Ooh. Please, no one else. Is my org level 100? I'm not sure it is. Let's take the org for it. Please don't kill me. Oh, that was a tire. I thought it was exploding. Um... It's my bike. I brought my bike over, right? It's down here somewhere. <laughs> I don't know what I did with my bike. Uh, where did it end up? Oh, fuck knows. Should be fine. I guess my bike kind of shot off a bit. Um, did it? How was his vest? Was it better? It's under the UAZ. Oh yeah, it is under the UAZ. I'm not sure I want to um go for that. Um... Oh. It's the guy behind me having a go now as well. Okay. Probably gonna get me here. Unless I get lucky. Whoop, boy. Hey, Chief, how you doing? You got a cup of tea and a caramel square in front of you. Oh, mate, that sounds lovely. Sounds excellent. Um, Did we establish what level is my org? It's not 100, is it? That's my org. Uh, 89. Okay, that's fine. Good, right. Because it'd be a pain in the ass if I realised it was already 100 and we had wasted all that effort. We got level 3 helmet. The vest took the brunt of that. <laughs> it's on 11 HP. I just saw a guy over here. But fuck all ammo left. Was that worth it? Nah, not quite sure, but whatevs, right? Whatevs. What's up, Smurny? How you doing? Anyone interested in Lost Ark at all? I haven't really looked at it, to be honest. Um, that guy just had sevens, didn't he? So, oh, can't believe he got away with that. Felt like we were going to get shot in the ass and die, to be honest, didn't it? I enjoyed blowing up this guy's car. That was that was very fun. Oh, hello.
I think there might be someone already in this compound. That's the next zone. It's a little bit. I'm guessing. I'm guessing. Did he drop two C4s? Oh my god. GG's. Because he carried on running then. I'm going to take the car. Not a very effective use of ammo, but, you know, it's done. Applying for your provisional driving license at the tender age of 41. Oh, nice. Oh, great effort. Good luck with it. I mean, I only did my driving test, what, a couple of years ago now? I I am I did it at, what, 35, 34? So, you know, a fairly, a fairly ripe old age, all things considered. Nice US skin, it is a good one, isn't it? So this guy might be jogging in. I don't know if he had another vehicle option over there. What's up, Saint Cesar? How you doing? Ah. Ooh. My vest is broken. Fuck you! Oh, and he shot me in the face. Not ideal. Oh, that's that's pretty bad as well. I'm gonna move. We landed some good shots on him there. We're gonna reposition. Try and get over here. This guy's got a grozer. <laughs> Broken vest is not going to help me win that fight. We got some really nice quick tags on him. I might risk just going to this compound where the Groza guy is and hope we can find a vest. This guy's pushing, I think. Or that might have been the um, buggy that I glimpsed. I'm not sure. Have I tried driving with Chewy yet to help him out? <laughs> I have not. He's not. He's not asked me about that. This guy's in there. Fuck that. Uh, okay. We've got much ammo. We haven't got a vest. You know, otherwise we're fine. Lived in London, London for 20 plus years, not felt the need before. But yeah, well, exactly. I've got to stop sp spraying or I'm going to run out of ammo here. Grows a man. Ah, oh, just missed the hip fire a little bit. I don't think we landed any shots. You just... Bit on the back foot there with our uh, setup. Stuff. Man, it's kind of warm today. Bizarre weather at the moment. I guess we've just not having winter this year. We didn't really have a summer last year. No winter this year. I guess that's, that's the planet now, right? It's like the 9th of February and I'm going to need to open the window because it's too hot in here. <laughs> What's up, Deng Deng? How you doing? That was good fun. We didn't get many kills, but it's good fun. Good little warm up.
It is a nice UAZ skin, that one. It's uh, one of the, like, uh, tournament ones. PCS or PGS or whatever. Chuck a cheeky little ad breakdown. Yeah, so the Orc does need a few levels. The Orc was on, what did we say? Like... 89 or something like that, I think. Where's my... I don't know why I'm struggling to find the org so much. Have I, have I just gone blind? Oh, there it is. Org A3. 89. M16 level 90. Hey, Alex. How you doing? So many people who are watching the stream in my game. How you doing, Alex? Nice to see you, buddy. Jacko, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How you doing today? Muffin man, lovely to see you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good, Jacko. Doing good. What's up? Full. Full full send, I guess that is. Good. We're just kind of warming up. Starting to use some wacky guns. The M16... I thought there were times I struggled with it, but when we fired those suppressed shots on that guy, we landed some nice little shots with it. But it's, at the moment, it's just one of those guns, like, why would you use it when you could use a mini? That is the thing with it. Why, you say? Because the mini is already level 100. Should we just hot drop school? See what we can find? Fuck it, right? When in Rome. If we die, we die. We've been blessed with two Erangel games to start the stream. We, we got a hot drop one. Hey, Mr. Birdie Love. How you doing? Boop. Like, crate games are, are useful for quite a few of the guns, but I do already have the Orman MK level 100 in any way, so... We definitely need to, um, if we're on Miramar, we've got we to gotta do crate games every single game and try and get the uh, uh, the links, right? We've got to get links kills. That's going to take some time. P90 we need to level a lot as well, obviously, because it's quite new. Hey, Stoked, how's it going? Lynch, welcome. No, it's only second game. I see a pistol or something there. There's a revolver. Oh, no, it's just a pistol. He didn't pick up a gun, I don't think. He's got a gun now. Lol. That's predictable. Anyone else? The backup. <laughs> uh, such a predictable move by that guy. You could hear him pushing me. I knew he'd come straight out of there. Oh, as soon as he jumped out the window, you can imagine the regret when he looked around. <laughs> Just saw me standing there waiting with a shotgun. I immediately regret this decision. GG's. Okay, let's go find more. This shotty needs leveling, so that's handy. You could come clay pigeon shooting with me. You know, definite clay pigeon vibes. Patiently shooting, right? Oh, hello, I see you. Owie. 
Oh, oh, that is a really bad time for my game to freeze up. Come on. Hey, buddy. <laughs> uh, cool. Thanks. So there's this lad over here. Jimmy the gun, thank you for the 15 months. Just Jimmy. Oh, it was a great shot. Great shot. GG's. There's stickers now. There are stickers. Yep, yeah, we got stickers. They have arrived. Uh, so we got the stickers, we got the beer mats slash coasters, if you don't know what a beer mat is. Uh, and we got another thing that's on it, well, that we're sorting out. So we should have, um, we should have our little beard guys, Patreon gift bags ready to send out within a couple of weeks, hopefully. Two or three weeks. Hey, doing, Kamisa, lovely to see you. Fun little school drop, enjoyed that. Alpha's having a nice little waff. Hot drop is good exactly as I can't do all crate games as your crate guns are pretty pretty up there. Yeah, I mean, well, the, the P90 has got a lot of levels to go, in fairness. Um, I think Tago is going to be good. I guess because on Tago, we can do, like, the big airdrops give you a good selection of crate guns so we can try and get MG3, P90. You know, Grozer and the Org do need a few levels, not many, but they need finishing. This map obviously also has the K2, which is very low, and the Q, the MK12. MK12 is going all maps in the next update, though, so that would be nice and easy to level up. How are you so calm? I'd be raging with that. How the fuck did he drop you so easily? He had an AK, and he shot me in the face with it. I wasn't on full health, so potentially he could have one-tapped me. If not, he would have killed me with a body shot and then a headshot. It doesn't take much with an AK. I was trying to shoot him with an AK, so... <laughs> If I'd hit him in the head, I would he would have died just as easily. Both trying to do exactly the same thing. I'd still be raging though. <laughs> Used to watch you guys alongside guys like Infidel. Yeah, he doesn't really stream anymore, I don't think. He kind of disappeared. Gonna watch Sing 2 today at the cinema because my girlfriend is still... Seven-year-old in her brain. <laughs> I don't really know what Sing 2 is. It doesn't sound... Oh, no, I think I saw an advert for that, actually. I think I saw an advert on the telly. Yeah, the stickers look amazing. They just arrived this morning. So these, this is part, so one of the things we're doing for our Patreon supporters, for our tier two and tier three supporters, we're putting together a little gift bag with some custom made, you know, patron exclusive Beard Guys merch that we're going to send out to people. That's getting sorted out at the moment. Um, there's still some more stuff to come, but um, we just got some stickers through today. We've got a whole load, got a shitload of these vinyl stickers um, of, of our Twitch emotes. That is a hundred of them. I've got a box of a thousand here. Let me get one out so you can see it a bit better. Um, so we got these really these nice little nice stickers of our emotes. Um, so we got the grenade. There's friend. There's gifty one. There's there's alphas. There's like there's the crate. There's GGs. There's it's fine. There's a whole bunch. And they look amazing. So uh, yeah, looking forward to getting that all all together. Uh, right, what do we want to do? Maybe we won't do quite the hot drop this time. We'll do like a medium drop. Go for a longer game. Has anyone heard from ATX? No, he isn't. He disappeared like two two or three years ago, right? Where are we going? This one. Books and Sar. Will they be going in any sort of merch store? Um, not at the moment. At the moment, they're just going to be for sending out to uh, to Patreons. We've got enough for 100 gift bags. There's currently about 40 people that are probably eligible 
to send them to. But we can, uh, you know, we can we can sort something out. And I feel like uh, I feel like our our mods deserve to just get get sent them anyway. So don't you worry. Just watch the new update video. Keep up. Thank you, Saint Cesar. Thank you very much, Mungo. How you doing? You're getting one G fiber internet. Excellent. Very nice. A couple of lads here. We want to keep an eye out for vehicles at the back here, so we can bust off and um, go for the super crate. Might get shot at the air if I'm not careful. This guy down was way down down way before me. See a K2, that'll do. Doop -doop -doop -doop. Kind of confuses me that it doesn't have a um a grip slot on it. It feels like it should. It feels like it needs one. Uh, I just want some armor. Or someone turns up and murders me. Armor, armor, armor. This loaded. I see a vest. Okay, we're going to go for it. It's a little bit in the open. But we've got to go for it. I mean, they all dropped kind of the other side. So unless they're super aggressive on my position. There's a man. There you go. K2 kill. Done. Eh. Um, do this. Boop. Cool. Alright. Uh, what's up, Sergeant Moto? How you doing? My week is going excellently, thank you. How's yours? Bouncy, bouncy. I heard a guy. Want this. Got one of those. That's fine. So I think there were about three guys here total. Just going to go check the vehicles real quick. That's the circle. We're a little bit out of it. Your crowbar is a shovel, that's cool. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? I like the little, um, some of the melee skins you get. It's normally quite good for vehicles down here, but I can't actually... Normally get, like, one there. And then you can get one over here as well. Oh, I see a bike, actually. Nice. Let's go grab this. EMT there. Swap me guns, so I feel... Feel happier. We're just in time for the plane, and it's a good bike, which should be um, hopefully you're right here, unless it goes really far away. It's reassuring that I can hear the plane already. We can hopefully you can just kind of follow it across the zone, unless it's drive already flown away from me. Huh? I thought hmm, I heard it. I heard the plane, but I don't see it. I guess it's already gone. Gone north somewhere. Where'd you go, sneaky plane? How did I not see you? Hmm, okay. Very sneaky. What's up, Sergeant Murray? How you doing? Just upgraded to tier two patron. Ah, thank you so much. Thank you, bloody legend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Remind me when I'm in between games and I'll um, update you on the, the bot so you get the extra audio commands. Hmm, man, I don't know where those crates went. I heard the plane for a minute. I think I just heard someone's car over here. Hmm, thought I heard a car. Maybe I'm just hearing things today. Maybe it's because I got the window open. Maybe I'm hearing shit outside. <gasps> Maybe that's it. Um, oh, hello, friend. <laughs> I 
<laughs> that was great. <laughs> oh, as soon as I heard that car, I was like, you're going to have a bad time, mate. You're going to have a bad time. Uh, hey, Gl Glizok, how you doing? I love that guy, just carried on driving as well. Mutant K2, yeah, sure. We need the ammo. We need a pan. Cool. All right. Well, we'll keep an eye out for more crazy crates. And here a guy firing distance. We'll go shoot him. Dude got run over. He definitely did. Let's go interrupt this fight. Doesn't sound too far away, really. He's getting, is he getting out of or just moving that? He's trying to move that to safety, I think. Ooh. Shot well. That is a, this is a terrible, this tree sucks. Ooh. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm really dead. Oh, I'm probably dead. Oh, I'm very close to being dead. This guy's shooting a pistol out of the window. Fuck me. Oh, GG's. Oh, what a terrible spot to be in. When is the official TBG PUBG controller being released? Oh, mate, my controller, just fucking bits have fallen off it. Honestly, it's a load of shit. They emailed me back. It's under warranty, but I've only had it six months. You shouldn't have bits falling off after six months. The guy who took the car could have just crushed you. Yeah, I don't know what he was doing, really. He kind of crashed into a rock and then tried to drive away. Amazing you didn't get hurt when your bike hit the car like that too. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't normally hurt you in things like that. If you get stuck against something, it will. But if you're like flying away, it'd be fine. Any updates on Nacho? Yeah, he's out of hospital. He stopped by chat a little while ago. Actually, he said hello. Like, I know it is a bit of a... Ch it's, but still, 75 quid isn't... You know, that's still a fair amount of money. So pretty annoying. Pretty annoying. They email back asking for, like, my, you know, proof of purchase today. Power A. So, I don't know. Hopefully they just send me another controller or whatever. But it's annoying if I'm going to... It's, it's not like... It's, it's just going to do the same thing again, right? Uh, so, I just have to keep... Getting them to send me another one every six months, I guess. Or buy a different controller. Other than that, it's been, other than breaking, it's been good. That is the downside of it, though. You sent me another pad option on Twitter. Uh, what is it? A turtle beach thing? Is that what you sent me? Looks very fancy, doesn't it? A re turtle beach recon. I've not heard of those before. So yeah, I don't know. I had my old Elite controller I had for quite a few years. It lasted me all right. It had horrible stick drift and had a sticky bumper button after a while, but nothing snapped off of it. Do you get the new warranty replacement? I don't know. That's what I need to see. Because if not, then, you know, that's not great, right? Almost got one. Glad I didn't. Yeah, I can't. I wouldn't recommend them. You've been proud of me yesterday. Land gun. Pushed a guy. Killed him for he had a chance to load his gun. Nice. I like the aggression. GG's. 
happy Wednesday. Got any guns to 100 yet? Uh, no, we've just been kind of shooting people with random bits and bobs. What's up, Animal? How you doing? What's happening? Where did I get the controller? Uh, through Amazon. I've already got a response from Powerade. They just um, asked for my proof of purchase. Try aim controllers. I've not heard of those. My lad is talking at the TV at you, Ben. He wants more parachute and he's covered in jam. That's all right. We'll get some parachuting in a minute. I'm just too cheap to buy a better controller. Well, it seemed like a good option because, like, like whatever controller you get, there's going to be someone who says they had a bad experience with it and someone who said they had a good experience with it, right? But, um... I just, like, the price of, like, the Elite is about 150 quid. Scuffs are nearer, like, 200 quid. Okay, let's just go balls deep in book again. It's going to be really busy, but fuck it. I can't help myself. I'm like, oh, let's do quieter drops. We last, and I'm like, hot drop! I don't use a standard Xbox controller. No, I use a Fusion Power A Fusion Pro 2. I just want any controller that has paddles on it and doesn't break after six months, really. That's the goal. It's just, you know, they just wanted a screenshot of my Amazon order. It wasn't anything like untoward. It's just a standard, standard shit. What's the benefit of the upgraded one? It's got paddles. So I can do my hold to crouch biz business. Business. Oh, that's bad. There's a man there. I got a vest! You coming? Is he coming? Oh, he bailed out. Okay, wow. Oh, you're there. <laughs> wow. The panic. Oh, he died. Come on, coming. We I mean, know there's a man in here. Because he just shot this guy. And shot at by this dude. Gotcha. Got him. Uh, so the ump still needs levels. So that is a, you know, a useful one. There's someone over here shooting at me. Or shooting at him, I should say. Where are you? Huh? Ah. Well, I hear him. Where'd he go? <laughs> wow. There he is. Uh, found him. Um, sure. Okay. Okay. Uh, hey, Wiki, how you doing? What do we want? Um, that's good. I not got much ammo, but whatever, right? We're just kind of shooting dudes. Just shooting people. It's fine. Definitely another guy here still. I think he was up top. We'll have a little look down here. Have a little look see. Ooh! It's not 
good. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I got the job done. Bit scrappy. Bit scrappy, but he's dead. Bid, guys. Um, Need ammo. Thank you. Let's see if there's a vehicle. Oh, that's very loud. <laughs> Beards. I meant. I think I meant to disable that one because it confuses me. I wanted to turn off the ones that we actually have as, um, you know, normal alerts as well. <laughs> it's quite confusing. Okay, here's another ump. Oh, should probably load my ump. Imagine chat is probably absolutely fuming about that. What's my favorite gun setup? I don't know. We're using all kinds of crazy stuff at the moment. Um, do we do? I think we'll we'll stick with the comp. It'll be fine. Should we put that on it for now? Here we go. Found any hidden gems you've forgotten about? We've only really done a couple of days of it so far, but um, I did enjoy that that mutant game I got the win on. Was a lot of fun on Monday. Uh, the VSS I've been enjoying a lot lately, particularly now it's got the, um, you know, with the canted on it. Aha, let's, um, there we go. And then we can get, um, there were some fives on this guy over here that we killed, wasn't there? Yeah, double fives, I think. This can take a, this as well, right? Yeah. So um, the the MK12 is going to all maps in the next update, so it's going to be a lot easier to level up. But you know, there's no harm in putting levels on it. There we go. Happy. Don't really need that much, I don't think. Let's try and find a vehicle. When do you do customs? Uh, Fridays. Every Friday. 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 Keep an eye out. There's probably still someone around. Um, kind of like half tempted to check for that vehicle, but there's also some distant shots. Maybe we'll just jog over here. There is a big road down here. We can look for more vehicles. You got the Razor Wolverine Ultimate. Interesting. Yeah, well, we'll see what, you know, we'll see what Power Ray say about the... Oh, there's a garage there. Let's check in there. You know, we'll see how they deal with this... Uh, this situation... You know, and then I can decide what, what, what to do. No. Yeah, you know, it is. It was nice to. It seemed like a good, good, good. Just hear a minute. It seemed like a good deal to only pay seventy-five quid for a controller because some of them are so expensive. But, um, yeah, just a bit disappointing. It's a bit cheap and shoddy. This is the zone. We're kind of east side of it. Um, I don't see any vehicles or any peoples. Let's go and check for the other the other vehicle spawn up here then. Hey, Pat Mustard, how you doing? Great to see you, mate. Did you watch uh, Great British Menu yesterday? I think I turned off balls because uh, that was one of the ones that was confusing because it's an actual like alert. So I hear the sound and I'm like, oh, someone subbed and then like no one subbed. Hence why I turned it off. <clears throat> no, you're away with work going to catch up tonight. Oh, nice, nice. Oh, you get a double whammy if you have time. Is the other vehicle here? I'm not sure it is, actually. Oh, well, we'll loop this way. I mean, this is more towards the center of the zone, so we'll just jog this way and look out for people, right? What we got? Four kills. Uh, they were all with guns that we need leveling up. The ump does need levels. It's not the hardest gun in the world to level up, obviously, but it's just not one I've used a ton. So we can level up the ump a little bit. MK12 is, like, super low level because it's pretty new, and it's on one map only, and I've not really used it very much. I like dropping here. It's turning into one of my new favorite drop spots on this map. It's nice to mix it up. Come on, where's some more boys? 
Well, boys, there's a lot of people left alive still. Everyone's very spread out. 55 alive at this stage is, is quite a few. Uh, we're also going to be doing Patreon squads on Saturday. This Saturday, by the way. Any Patreon people or people want to sign up on Patreon. I'm going to get started at like 10 a.m. My time. Going to go through till 5 or 6 o'clock in the evening. Try and play with as many of our Patreon supporters as I can. Lamb is also going to come and join. There's someone sniping over here we need to watch out for. No idea where he went. Uh, yeah, Lammy is going to be coming over for part of the stream on Saturday, which is going to be great. He's going to join us in the afternoon, so we can have me and Lammy, the mysterious other beard guy, squatting up, squatting up together. Uh, it's another um, another plane, but we don't have a vehicle. Oh well. What do you mean, level up the weapons? Uh, they, you can level them up on the weapon mastery system. You can get them from level 0 to 100. And you get little charms you unlock, you can put on them. Not that we're really too bothered about that. There's a vehicle there. We had to get that bike. It's pretty open, but I hate not having a vehicle. I hate it. Oh, hello. You're up there somewhere. Quite sure where. Do we have any smokes when we take this vehicle? We do. Excellent. Excellent. Customs are really fun. They're great, aren't they? Best part of the week. And it's a Friday, so it's doubly good. Oh, bastard. I wanted that. Well, he's off. Um... Okay, well, scratch that plan. We'll just go to the play zone, I guess. Keep a wandering through the wilderness. I'm a wandering man. If we can see this guy, we can take a cheeky shot at him. We saw his vehicle up here earlier. Hmm. I'm not sure where he is, though. There was a random um, bike sitting around up there earlier. I can't see it now. You enjoyed customs last week? Excellent. Excellent. Oh, there's his bike. Yeah, it was a good session last week, wasn't it? Did enjoy it. Oh, this is one of the secret rooms. I think. Shame we don't have a key. Anyone opened it? No. Hey. <laughs> Come back! Uh, okay, let's get into these trees. We don't just run through this massive open field. It's going to be awful. Game presets, such a game changer for Friday customs. Yeah, absolutely. I want to try and do um, quite a few games on Karakin this Friday, I thought, because... Um, because that's going to come back into map rotation in the next update. And anyone who's new to PUBG isn't going to have had a chance to play it yet. So uh, we're going to try and do... I'll come up with some good game modes to Karak. And I might try and make some new presets for it tomorrow to save and get ready to play. And then we can just do some, um, you know, some fun shenanigans on Karak. Everyone can learn the new map before. Well, not new, but, you know, kind of new back in rotation. Get familiar with the map again before it uh, comes out. Hey, Doodle Man, how's it going? Good to see you. God, what a what a funny little game. It's so rare that I'm actually running around on a map, isn't it? I always have a vehicle and then... <laughs> oh. Random bike. Mysterious bike. On a rock. Whose bike are you? We don't extend them. The ump is a bit annoying. I feel like he's going to be chilling on the rock next to it, or the one behind. Unless he dumped it and then just jogged in. Or it, or it's out of gas, I guess? Why are you here? Hmm. 
Okay. Am I going to shoot me? Seems okay. Let's go find people. Very south circle. We had that really south one the other day, didn't we? On Monday, at the end of the stream, the I got killed by Gar in the end, didn't I? Um, but that was a really, really south circle. It was quite good fun. We should try and get a um, an airdrop and get level 3 gear, really. Would be wise, I think. Given how much level 3 gear is around on this map. It's not a guy, is it? It's a bike. I don't think we've heard a plane for a while either, so hopefully we won't have to wait too long. Go and see if we can see this ump guy. It sounds quite busy down here. At that compound. Maybe poach a sneaky kill. I'm safe from Gargod today. I'm always safe from Gargod. What are you saying? I can look after myself. Oh, there is a man. Guy driving in. The other guy down here had a canine, so we need to be careful. Yeah, that guy. Go back to my bike. What's up, Honey Badger? How's it going? Good to see ya. Well, whenever this next plane comes, I think it's going to get pretty spicy. I haven't heard one for ages, and the circle's pretty small with quite a few people left. I feel like we've got a good vantage point here. It's kind of weird position, that car there, isn't it? I can see you. What's this Lost Ark game? Oh, I don't know. Some some new game. By Amazon or something, right? Some new shit. Half the people I follow on Twitch are playing it. Yeah, it had loads of viewers, so I guess everyone kind of gets on that on that hype train, right? And it's got drops. People love a drop. Is it? It's like an MMO again, right? Like, um, what's the one that was really big for a bit and then seems to have gone quite new? New World, whatever it was. The other Amazon one that was massive on Twitch for like a month. Where's all the players? Where's all the freaking players? Where's the plane? No plane, no players. No one here? There's gonna be some random Larry, like running around, wouldn't you? Nothing. Just new, seems like new world. I thought that was the freaking crate. It's these trees. Every night you see them, it looks like the smoke from the crates, isn't it? How have we not bumped into anyone? Oh, God. I was hoping if we got lucky, we might find like a random old crate drop, you know. It's Tago, everyone hides in buildings till the last circle. It does seem to be the case, doesn't it? Does seem to be the case. I watched the YouTube duo with Nacho. GG's. Cheers, Kane. How you doing, mate? Everyone's playing Stream Snipe Hide and Seek. Nah, the Stream Snipers wouldn't last this long. They're all trash. They'll be dead by now. Playing, there we go, finally. That's what we wanted. I wanted to go deep. Go deep. It's going a bit deep. Yeah, okay. Nah. Well, it's in the town, actually. 
It's gonna be it's gonna be exciting. I'm gonna get shot in the ass while I'm looting, but sure. Let's go have a look. Runaway chicken. Please don't shoot me in the ass. I just want to live. Where's the good crate over here? Cool, okay. We got the armor, that's the main thing. Just gonna skim them real quick and look for a P90. Not really bothered about anything else. Like MG3s are easy to get. <laughs> Where are all the people? What is going on? We gotta get to the next play zone. That's not too bad. Okay. Uh, short bus. Thank you for the 21 months. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Cheek pad. Bit of bag. Oh, we got a three bag already. Madness. There was some over here, but I think that's fine, right? Real good. Hello? It was a sniper suppressor, wasn't there? Let's check that one, I guess. All of the stuns. Zones are coming. We gotta go. Should have gone earlier. I didn't realize it was um, already coming. Oopsie. Whoopsie. Hey, Casey. How's it going? It's my bike. I forgot that was here. Ooh, that is very convenient. Accidentally found my own bike. Oh, this is sketchy. This is sketchy. That's how I park. There's a man. Oh, it's a bike. There's a man in a ghillie. I see you. You go inside or behind, do you think? He's behind. Thank you, stuns. Mini and an org. Ah, eh, we'll stick with what we got, I guess. Ah, fuck it. Let's try and finish the uh, org. Ooh. Cool. Thank you. Have one of these. I guess the uh, the org's going to be harder to get than an ump, right? So I guess always go for the crate guns till they're leveled up. What type of controller do I use? Oh, we got a command for it in chat. It's a power power a fusion pro 2 uh broken i should add <laughs> exclamation mark controller gives you a link to it on the plus side of it breaking though it means i can offer some feedback to people on power raise um you know warranty and support process nine alive 
We've only got five kills, nothing crazy, but it'll be good XP for the guns because we got far through it. So we can just pick up a couple more kills, that'd be handy. Oh, uh... One lad over there. They killed him. There's someone shooting over here. That guy got quite a nice spray on him in the um in the porter there. There was a suppressed shot from over here. They might be a bit distracted looking at that car, hopefully. They're gonna be close. What are you? I'm prone? Are you in? Oh, you're down there. I see. Was it you? I feel like it wasn't you. I feel like it was someone closer there. Where is, where is that from? This guy just booped a guy with his M24. Got there in the end, not great shooting, but he's dead. There's still quite a few alive. I think there was another guy on a tree on the edge over there, wasn't there? I don't think that was him. Guess there's someone over here then. I don't know if the bolt action guy is the guy in the window or the guy who's fighting here, but see if we can poach a kill. Yeah, that was the guy who had the bolty before. Where it is everybody? Oh there's a man. Where did you come from? Sneaky. God I'm fucking shit with this thing. Jesus. Two guys driving around in cars now. ignoring the guy with the bolty. There's like two guys in cars and then the, the guy with the bolty. Oh, i got to go right towards the other guy. These cars might be a nice little distraction then. I'm not quite sure where bolty guy is. He might still be in that house. He's there. Get it. Be worried about this bush guy on the left now getting a shot. Why is this guy's not even trying to run me over when he has the chance? State of this. Shoot the car guy. Ooh. There's still this guy on my left on that car. Pretty sure he's still there. Yeah, he's still there.
Oh, how we missed some of those early shots. GG's. <laughs> There's the other guy. He was hiding there for so long. Man, the old school car plays, yeah, it's kind of like Demo Derby. So that's what it was like on PUBG for the first, like, six months after release. People used to drive around cars like crazy early on, but they're just so weak now. Hey, Thunderlost, how's it going? Please play private. No, I like everyone to see. Eight kills is good in the end. What's up, Clout? How's it going? It's always annoying. It's more annoying that there's no one else shooting them when, like, no one else bothers shooting the car, guys. Hey, Swoop. How you doing? Brian, how's it going? Thanks for the patch notes video. Didn't realize we were that close. Yeah. Yeah, it's out on uh, test server now for PC. Uh, what's up, Buster Guts? How you doing? Have I tried a scuff controller? I haven't. Hey, Red Bearded. Triple Fried, how's it going? Scout Wolves, what's up? Uh, we've got a command in chat for my sends if you want to see it. There you go. Check it out. Well, we probably did some pretty good um, weapon XP in that, right? Because we got to, like, top three kills. All the kills are with guns we need to level up. Hide my face so you can see this. So we did 10k XP on the ump is good. 7k on the org. 5k on the MK12. So you do get quite a bit just for getting late game. Like, we only had a few kills there. We, we only got one kill with the MK. I guess it's damage, though, isn't it? We did nearly 200 damage with the MK12 and got 5,500 XP because we got right to the end of the game. Like 200 damage is two kills, basically. We only did 177 damage with the Org, but we had two kills and a headshot. So yeah, it's um, good. Certainly longer games are the way, way to level stuff up, aren't they? MK12, a god weapon. Yeah, I didn't do great with it in that gun. It's one of those guns people are like, oh, yeah, if you lay prone, it's great. But, like, you know, when do you ever lay prone, right? Org 89. Yeah, Org's pretty high. I've got plenty. I've got one MP5s on level 99, Grozer's on 99. But we're not really focusing. We're not focusing on the ones that are nearest. If anything, I'm focusing on the ones that are furthest because then it's going to be less painful, right? If I just do the ones that are nearest, they're all the ones that I use anyway and are easy. And then it's going to end up with, like, all of the hardest, shittest guns with, like, 90 levels left of them. So I'm trying to, like, you know, keep mixing up and using stuff that's a bit lower down. They are indeed, Mr. Redbearded. They are indeed. Dagnabbit! That's the kind of games we need to have to level stuff up. Obviously, you know, if we have 15 kills and win, it's better. But that's, that's a really good one for leveling. I've had a hard time with the MK14. Oh, mate, I fucking love that gun. I love it. Got to get those crossbow kills in. Yeah, yeah. I do have to do that. I'll just be OB26. Uh, Hassan, thank you for the 21 months. Cheers, mate. How you doing today? Thanks for all the subs and resubs. Six already today. Love that. Still well over 500 subs on Twitch. Incredible. You have effects on your left. Very nice. Two bends. I've got my eyes on a Power A Fusion 2 controller. Would you say having the extra paddles helps? It does, but my controller is broken at the moment and I'm trying to get it replaced. So, um, yeah, I would uh, maybe reconsider whether that's a good option. You have the beard guys on your screen. <laughs> oh my god. It's the beard guys. I guess the plus side of um the plus side of leveling up stuff that's like, you know, finishing off ones that are already high level and just getting them up to a hundred early. The benefit of doing that is it makes it a bit easier to decide what to pick up, right? Because at the moment I'm like, oh there's so many different things. Do I take this? Do I take this? I guess if I finish off like the guns that are already level ninety plus. You know, that's like eight or nine weapons that we don't need to worry about using anymore. Like MP5, M249, G36 we want to try and use because um, Vikendi's going out of rotation. So it'd be nice to finish off the G36 before um, before the update because we don't know when we'll get Vikendi back. 
There's one guy. Kind of lost track of him, but he'll be about. Ooh, sure, get rid of that. There's a helmet over there. You could find one in the, the Arizona Ontago. That is true. Very good point. Any bags? Any vests? Take a bag. Kind of thought the loot in here would be a little bit better, to be honest. Might take this. Might consider using that. where this guy landed he could be here he could have backed out and gone elsewhere they normally go for like either this oh hello thank you they normally go for the central bit or these two warehouse big red warehouses i can't see him in here i'd like if they put paramo back yeah i enjoy paramo Oop. Um, cool. We need. <laughs> hey, Joe. How you doing? Um, we need to get rid of this AK. Only pretty quiet around here, isn't it? Boom. There we go. Nice. What I really want on that is a um, is a three X. Trying to see if this guy's around. I think he fully bailed out. Scavenging the Arizona in Tago for a G36. Sounds like a great time. Exactly. What could be more fun? We've got a little way to go to the zone here. I might take this bike just in case. It's very quiet. Very peaceful. Yeah, G36 and a 3X is a is a really fun setup to use. We used to do that quite a lot. It's been, it's been a while though. Just a barrel. Hey hippie, how you doing? M24 is already leveled. Aha. Friend. Deary me. Deary me, sir. Um, cool. All right. What did you have? Um, this guy, sure, lots of ammo, beautiful. Let's go MP5, just because it's a map, kind of a map-specific gun, right? Rather than, um, the ump is on every map. I mean, also, MP5 is level 99, so we might be able to level it up. I'm going to suppress it, because it just sounds great. Not that it really needs, doesn't really need the comp anyway, right? Um, cool, all right. I still want a 3X rather than, um... I don't want all these mollies, really, because I don't want to just burn everyone. I want to... we got to shoot them with guns, right? Get the guns leveled up. Uzi close combat melts. Um, yeah, it does certainly melt. But we've already got the Uzi to 100, so... You don't, don't need to. Don't need an Uzi. An extended quickie? Nope. It is not. Six X would also be useful if we can't find a three. 
Did I drop on my 9 mil or am I like... Did I just not have any? Am I... Am I just... I don't know. Whatever. There we go. Uh, Chief, how you doing? Smokes and stuns. Or you can have... I mean, it's, it makes sense, wouldn't it? It would make sense. I don't really want to carry this bike, but I've been burnt before where I've like not picked one up and then regretted it when I needed to get to the play zone, so... Just being cautious. They are super handy, but... You know, they uh, they take up a lot of bag space. Bison's going to be quite fun to level up, I think. I quite enjoy using the bison. You know, a little bit unusual. Nice, it's handy. I don't think we really need the canted on here, do we? Ooh. Like, if we're running the MP5, there's no point using the canted. I'm sure we'll get by all right with the 4X for now. Uh, how you doing, Hacky Life? How's it going? Twisty, great to see you. Double MP5s. Double MP5s would do it, but I don't think we need to run doublers to to get this done, right? Oh, one of those. Looks a bit like a three vest. It ain't. Thank you. I should also carry that pistol just in case, right? In fact, let's go back and grab that extended that we dumped. And then we can whip this out. If we see someone who's, a, you know, looks very, very vulnerable. Oh, there's a car there. Like that first guy I killed. If I'd had a pistol, he would have been a definite guy <laughs> to grab a pistol kill with. On. Uh, where did I dump that extendy? Oh, there was a freaking flare gun sitting right here. <laughs> Hands up if you saw the flare gun. <laughs> no one called it. Okay, we don't need the extended anymore because I just found a flare. The mysterious flare. All right, let's get in the play zone, get that, and get some armor. Scorpion, best pistol in the game. Well, that is that is true. It is pretty good. Okay, let's go go play. Someone's already flared. They've got the BRDM. We're gonna go to the zone and we're gonna try and get um, you know, the good shit, the armor. My buddy's giving me hell for trying to level up my guns, but I think it's sort of fun. Yeah, it is fun. Otherwise, it's just sit here playing PUBG exactly the same way every single day. People don't want to watch that shit. They want to watch me getting 15 kills with a DP and a mutant. Am I right? Ooh. Any baddies? Let's get it down into the zone a little bit and then we should be in the next play zone and then we can pop the flare. Oops. Can't drive through Dino Land very easily. Wait, what? It is a hard game, Stokes. It is a tough one. It takes a bit of getting used to. Have you leveled up the Panzerfaust? I don't think you can level up the Panzerfaust, right? It's not on the uh, it's not on the list. Sadly. Oh, that it were. But it ain't. Please don't go over that hill. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Get in! Oh, I do that all the time. You think I'd learn? You think I'd learn? Never do. How come you make it look easy? Well, because you've played for five weeks and I've played for four years, Mr. Stokes. That's why. And half the people I'm now playing against have been playing the game for five weeks. Imagine a game where you ran nothing but nades. Oh my god, look at this play zone. He went a bit weird for a sec there, but I, I think I waited all right. That's a crazy south play zone.
I hate when I push a player and I think they're because I think they're new. They end up being really good and lasering the shit out of you. Yeah, it's a bit of an issue. You get so used to just fighting like newbies and then you bump into a decent player and it kind of screws you. Right, we just got to chill, mate, for this crate so we can get the armor. If it's a crate gun we need to level, then I'll I'll probably take it. Well, I don't know. We've got a nice lev nice loadout to level here. Let's ditch the bike. We don't want that anymore. We don't need it. Explosives can't be leveled up. Makes me sad. Yeah, I wish you could level up. I would definitely have frags to be there. <laughs> It'd be great trying to like farm molly kills or something, wouldn't it? Just gotta watch my ass here. Smoke ready for emergency situations. Let's drop one of these mollies as well for extra bag bag space. We got a little bit of bag space. I guess we dropped the bike, didn't we? But it's worth having a bit. What's your favorite drop spot to drop? On all of the maps? Or like one for each map? Uh, I mean, it depends what we're doing. On here, I like... I hear Villa for just crazy spicy drops. Or Cement Factory for a bit more of a chilled out experience. Coal Mine, like we dropped here, is also kind of okay. It's normally like... Has one or two people and... Easy to get loot. Uh, Erangel, School, Millie Base, Big Power. Miramar, Power Grid, and Hassi. Literally nowhere else. Everywhere else is terrible. Anyone coming? Mm, I'm not going to take an MG3. We do need to level the MG3, but we're not going to do that now. <laughs> we're going to get these ones done. We got the armor, right? Yeah. Uh, hey, Skyman, how you doing? Ah, uh, nice. That's awesome. I'm so glad you're enjoying the game. Great to hear. We haven't killed anyone. Oh, no. I killed one person. When did I... Oh, that guy right at the start. Yeah, okay. Did I just see the main crate up there? No, it's like a red tarp. Okay. Man, this is a really, really nutty circle, isn't it? I tell you what, this car sticks out like a sore thumb. Ugh. <sighs> I saw some people to shoot. There's a car. We do still need a 3x, I guess. He's lost a tire, but he's still still just going for it. Okay, well, maybe we'll give chase. Well, I need to level the MG3, so it, now at least there's a positive to getting it. Let's just chase this guy. He's got out there, okay. He didn't seem hyper-aggressive, which is normally reassuring, right? Didn't kill this guy. It's got a shotgun. This guy. Be careful.
Where'd the other guy go? Molly kill, no use to me. It's over here somewhere. There we go. That makes up for it. He was lucky to get away with that drive by. I hit him hard. You can grab a pistol now too. That is true. Blue up. Maybe we don't need the uh, 3x. <laughs> 4x is doing all right. Who threw that? Oh, this guy threw it, I guess. Right. K9 M4. Um, cool. We could do a tiny bit more fives. We haven't got anyone with the MP5 yet, have we? And did we get that guy early? Or no, we got. That was before I picked it up. I think that was the ump. Where did this guy die? Oh, he jumped out the window and died, I think. Balcony? Yeah. Okay, well, that seems quiet. SKS pump. Ooh, okay. Okay. I'm going to leave the frags just because. Um, You know, we don't want to kill too many people with frags and mollies. And on a bike. Did you shoot some other dude? There was some dude really close to me just shot. There was some fucking dude just like laying in front of him. He just got shot in the ass by this this guy. This he shot this guy. Like this guy was just laying there with just an M4, no armor, no helmet. <laughs> oh, I missed that. GG's. Uh, what do we need? I'll take I'll take that comp. Oh, that's not good. Let's get out of here. Get into a safer position. Seems we've got two different dudes who know where I am. Oh, we're very open. We're very open. I was tempted to grab the scorpion, but not worth it at this dangerous situation. Plus, scorpion's going to be easy to level anyway. Do -be -do -be -do. Go to you. Use that. Okay, we're into the late game again. This is going to be good for uh, gun leveling. We're going to have a nice little bonus on these kills. Let's try and pick up a few more. Not quite sure where that guy was. Like back across the road or something. All of the cars. Are we all loaded? We are. He's kind of out over there somewhere, I think. Well, there's the guy. Is that guy? Yeah, gilly guy there. Let's wait and see if he gets in a shitty position. There we go. Got there in the end. Jesus. Level 3 gear. Took a pound then. Oh, he took a pound then. Anybody else? He's pretty chilled. I didn't pick up a 3... Was there a 3x? Oh, it's fine. We're getting alright with the 4, to be honest. But thank you. Uh, he was definitely pulling off some sweet 360s. Yeah, it's some moves. Moves like Jagger. 
Where have these guys ended up? Was that a guy? Nope. I mean, it might have been the ghillie guy that shot at me originally from down there. Not the sniper. The bolt action was further along. We shot back at him. But, um... Ghillie guy might have been, uh... The guy who fired the suppressed shots, I guess. I just want to grab a touch more fives of one of these crates. Thought I saw someone. Those are all the dead dudes. You, you had a bit of fives. The strange man who just had the M4 and nothing else. Anyone coming in? Seems pretty chilled. Pretty relaxed. Yeah, it's dark, isn't it? That is night mode. It is Vikendi night mode or dusk or whatever it is. It's got to be someone knocking around on this side of the circle, right? Some late entrant. Nearly top 10. You're pissed at black magic today. I don't know what that is. I'm, you know, happy for you to share your frustration. There's a dead guy. Uh, I mean, there was a guy around here, but we're kind of going away from the zone, but... Yeah, uh, sure. We can get to these trees and then work our way up the tree line, up the road, can't we? We might get a cheeky shot here. A cheeky shot? I don't see anybody. I don't see any cheeky ass shots. Been pretty quiet for a while. How's the leveling going today? Yeah, good. Just kind of chipping away, really. Oh, there's a man. Oh, we hit him in the head. Guess he stopped on that rock. Headed him again. And again. Well, maybe I didn't head him with one of them then. Bit right about getting shot in the ass here, but I want to wait and try and confirm this kill. Because the zone's going to push him pretty soon. Fuck you, I'm not letting the blue take that. God, I'm going to get killed by someone else here, surely, though. Fuck it, I was so open. Oh, there's a man. Okay, this, thankfully, thankfully the blue was a little bit slower than I thought it was, so. I got away with that. Still quite a few lads left here in a pretty small zone. <laughs> the fucking guy. Someone just tagged me from over there just as I peeked out. Is he proning? I'm not really sure where this guy is. Let's go have a look. Oh, I see him, I see him. Yep. Not got much ammo left in the G, but we've got plenty in this. Still four alive, man. Everyone's prone in at the end, don't they? Jesus. Sneaky snakes. Crap. 
crash. There's a man. Oh, he's dead. Also move in. And if they're both here or not. He's got a shotty, so we need to be a little bit cautious. Actually, the circle's coming over here, so I don't know what I'm doing. Terrible shooting, but he's dead. And there's the last guy. Oh, we need to do better than that. Oh, there we go. There we go. Messy, but we got a job done. That's going to be good XP. That's good XP. But that'll probably be the MP5 to 100 as well. I reckon. Uh, Spot Hunter, how's it going? So, Ben, my very good friend wants to know what needs to be done to get one of those Alfie stickers. <laughs> so, there for our Patreon um, gift bags for Tier 2 and Tier 3 patrons. But I would also like to send them out when we do them to our mods. So, don't worry. Kamisa asked earlier as well. Hey, Hollywood. How you doing? Great to see you. Murderface, welcome, welcome, welcome. So, don't you worry your sweet little ass, bri bri. I mean, ignoring the fact that you've, you know, gifted an outrageous amount of subs. He should have let you, never let you that close across the open. No, that is true. But I was, I was peeking it very slowly. So if he had peeked out, I would have killed him probably quite easily as well. But yeah, good game. Let's see what we did XP wise. Bada bada bum. But yeah, we've just got one more thing to sort for the Patreon gift bags, which hopefully we'll have in a couple of weeks. And then, hello. And then Lammy is going to start posting them out to everyone or everyone who wants one from Patreon. Brian, thank you so much for the gifties. You absolute legend. Subs going out to Andre W. Hillman to Nauta King to Solvables Wine, Punisher EU, and I, Semyon. Sem1, something like that. Simeon. Thanks, Brian. You bloody legend. First Saxoid of the day. First big gifties of the day coming down. Thank you very much. Um, how did we do in the old match history then? Let's have a little look. Hide my face for a minute so you can see the weapon XP. That is going to be level 100. Easy peasy, right? Max level. Bang. Nice. MP5 done. Uh, G36 is on 97 now from 96. It's nearly up to 98. And Ump is up to 76. We had one kill with that. Four kills with the MP5. Five with the G36. Uh, one with the Ump. Very nice. There we go. One more to um, one more ticked off. Don't need to use the MP5 anymore. Thank you, Brian. UK Logics, how's it going? Nice to see you. I pulled a Lammy with your headset today. Oh, you smacked yourself in the eye with it. <laughs> Nicely done. I can only congratulate you. He's going to come over on Saturday and join us for Patreon squads. Not for the whole, um, the whole thing, but for um, the afternoon session. Did you miss a chicken? You did. I just won a game. I won a game. Ooh, first sound of the day. Good progress. No ad break while we're loading in here. So, yeah, that's the MP5 up to 100. That's one more gun. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13 at 100 now. Refresh this. We can bring up our little list for you. And there we go. Grozer is close. Grozer, Grozer, Pump, QBZ. 
QBZ would be a good one to use on here. Level 98. And the QBU, I imagine, is quite low level. 64, because I don't use that very often. We'll try and run a QBZ in something else then this game, I think. Will be good. The QBZ. In your running experience, how fucked am I for missing 10 days of training due to COVID? Um... I mean, it's not, it's not, you'll, you'll definitely like, you'll definitely lose form for missing 10 days of training. It will set you back. But, um, it's, it's more about, I guess I'd be more concerned about how like COVID might affect your aerobic, aerobic system, you know, your, uh, your breathing and stuff, um, when you do get back into running. But I think the key is, you know, you can't do anything about that now. Right. I think what, I think the best thing to keep in mind when you're coming back from having time off, that you didn't want to take then you're training for a big race. Don't overdo it when you go back into it. Just don't try and dive back in where you should have been on your training program. Just go in, you know, go in nice and gently. Ease yourself back in. And just take it steady. Otherwise, if you just try and pick up where you should have been, you're just going to, like, injure yourself and set yourself back even further. So just, just try and do, lot. you know, don't worry about speed at all. Just try and get out and do some runs. Doesn't matter how slow you're going. Just get out and run. And build up gently go in gingerly yeah exactly you know you still when's the what well, you're training for manchester right when's that that's what is it next month sometime late next month as long as you can try and build yourself up to getting a, a couple of you know long runs done a couple of weeks two three four weeks before you know if you can get yourself out and get a 16 to 20 mile runs done a couple of times no matter how slow you're going You'd be right. A few boys and girls here. Ah, should have pre-fired more. Start of April. Okay, so you've still got... Yeah, you've got the whole of March and the whole of February. I think you'd be fine. I've missed 10 days of training due to crappy work shifts and laziness. I haven't not run for 10 days for a long time. I, I, had, I took six days off of running the other week because my ankle had got sore, and that felt like... A really long time. It's still been a bit sore after some of my runs lately. I don't know what is wrong with my ankle, but I did that big run on Sunday. It was just a little sore after that, but not, but not bad. So I don't know what's wrong with it. It seems to be slowly healing up. The runs don't seem to be making it get worse, but it's taken a little while to, to heal up. Might be tendonitis. Yeah, I don't know really. It doesn't really hurt when I'm running. It doesn't affect my running. It's just been a little bit achy afterwards. But it's only come on like when I did a really heavy week in January. What's a big run for me? Um, well, it's more the elevation than the distance. It was about twenty. It's about half marathon distance trail run we did on Sunday. But it was uh, over six hundred meters of elevation, two thousand feet of elevation. So, pretty, pretty hilly. You know, I'm half marathon's not a cakewalk either, I guess. I did have a gammy knee that's healed now, so that's welcomed. Yeah, I mean, rest is rest is always good, right? I'm taking it easy at the moment till my ankle feels 100% again. I didn't run with club last night. Um, but I'm, I, might, I think I'm going to go for a run after the stream today. Just go for a little run and just see how it feels. Uh, I use Strava to track my runs. Hey, Queenie. And I have the Garmin software as well, but I don't really tend to use that too much. Is there a mile you considered the hardest to overcome in a marathon? Um, 
no, I mean, I've, so I've run three marathons before. I've done London once and Brighton a couple of times. But I, I think the thing is how I run the last couple of years, my training is a lot better structured and better quality than I ever used to train when I ran back in the day. So I think it'd be a much different experience for me running a marathon now. I would say, you know, getting, getting from 20 to 26 is is really hard. That's, you know, that's really hard. <laughs> that's That's tough. Unless you've like done absolute shitloads of training that's going to be uh that's going to be the tough bit the really tough bit all of it like a marathon is not twice as hard as a half marathon a marathon is way harder than a half marathon i feel like if you know if you run reasonably regularly you could just go out and knock out a half marathon you know maybe not a record pace but you could go and run a half marathon like you know without really having to train for it if you're a regular runner but to do a marathon like you could be running regularly and go and try and run a marathon and you it'd be pretty tough i use garmin for tracking my workouts i'm a big fan yeah i've got i have like a garmin watch so it goes on to garmin and then it goes on to strava i mostly look at strava but there's a couple of bits i look at garmin i look at it for like my vo2 max and stuff like that. Not that that really matters to my level of running, but it's just, you know, just something it tracks, I guess. Should check out last one standing by Atlas Running in Northern Ireland. Hell of a trail event. Ah, interesting. I would like to do some, like, unusual trail events over the next few years. I, You know, I did a lot of road racing before and, um, you know, a little bit last year as well. I'd like to do more trail events. I'm doing North Downs Run for the second time. This year, that's a 30k trail race, really near where I live. Um, and I'm in, I've got London Marathon this year as well as Beachy Head Marathon. Beachy Head is a trail marathon. They're both in October this year. Um, UK Postman. Oh, sorry, mate. One of my own. UK, that is. I'm not a postman. Don't know if you knew. Who to push? This guy. There was a guy below me in here as well. This guy. Cool. Still haven't got a vest or a helmet, but we've killed... There we go. Killed three people. Need a helmet. Got a helmet. There's a guy over here. I'm kind of tempted to go looky. I just glimpsed him in this doorway. Fuck. That's a red dot. I didn't put it on. Didn't even equip it. That wasn't the guy I was pushing, I don't think, unless he made a crazy move. I just heard him scampering around back there. Take all that shit, we can, uh... Hold that thought. Run away! I mean, nice idea. It did say something in the patch notes about fixing a bug that makes it select the bottom of the inventory. I don't know if that's this bug. It's pretty annoying. Hope it is. Do I turn off crossplay? I do not turn off crossplay, no. I would never recommend turning off crossplay unless you like playing against more bots. Um, yeah, it's not a 
Not a good idea, really. Doesn't doesn't help anything. Uh, Kira, how you doing? Imagine running the ump. Hello. Hi. How you doing? Hello, lovely boys. Been running the ump loads recently, thanks to my new pursuit of weapon masteries. What did we say the QBZ was? Level 98 or something? The good thing with the weapon master is, well, yeah, the good thing with the weapon master is that it's, um, it's damage focused rather than kill focused. So, um, you know, it doesn't matter if you do a bunch of damage and finish them with a different gun. That's kind of fine. Because you're still going to get XP for it, even though you didn't get the kill shot. It's not about just like poaching that one cheeky, you know, last bullet kill that gets the XP. GG's. Struggling with the 4X on that thing there with no grip. That's pretty wild. How hairy do your trail runs get? Do you encounter mud, water hazards, obstacles? Um, they're not like... They're not hairy, I would say. They're, you know, they're reasonably technical in parts. You know, definitely plenty of mud. You know, with rocky bits. A lot of it is running through like woodland and trails through through woods and stuff like that um not really like crazy crazy obstacles just you know just mud and mud and tracks there's loads it's there's loads of like nice trails you can follow around so it's all you're not like you know hacking through the undergrowth or anything yeah the three x is nicer for spraying for sure tree roots a lot of roots absolutely I think I'm going to let go of all speed sessions and just focus on mileage. I think that's a great idea. Absolutely. Absolutely. Three Sanox in a row. Okay. I think it's trying to tell me something. We need to get the QBZ done. Need to get it done, boys. Yeah, it's really nice for, uh, for running around here. It's interesting. I like... I, so I was talking to a friend of ours who ran in our running club, lives in Dublin now. And he was saying it's really tough to go trail running there because um, there's just not like England has a really good like system of public rights of way where you can just kind of go anywhere. Like when there's farmers fields and shit, there's always there's just public footpaths that go everywhere along the side of fields and through all this land. Whereas he said in Ireland, they just don't have that. So you can't just go out kind of running and because you just, it's all private property and you just can't, you can't get through as easily. So, um, but it's something that was interesting because I'd never really, you know, thought about that. I was like, oh, surely everyone can just kind of go out into the countryside and just run and there's, you know, paths and stuff. But apparently we're, you know, a little bit spoilt with that in, uh, in England. I imagine, I think Scotland's meant to be pretty good for it as well. I don't know about Wales. And the valleys. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. I need to, uh, I heard of Robert De Castello. Uh, I don't know. It kind of rings a bell. I'm not sure. I've watched a couple of videos recently of trail runners. I don't know if I've, I don't know if I've heard of Castello. I've only kind of, I've only really got into trail running over the last couple of years since I started running with my running club. Um, let's do one more booty, shall we? I know let's do something different. We'll go heart in. We'll go a bit different. Mix it up. I always run along the coast when I can. Nice. It's so much nicer than just running around town. Like, just getting out of town and running is, is just lovely. Bit of a champion of the 80s. Ah, okay. Nice, nice. We have a lot of hiking paths here in south of Ireland. Nice. 
Yeah, we're, um, Beachy Head Marathon is going to be full on. I've never done a trail marathon before. I did North Downs. The first trail race I did was last year, and that was North Downs, which is 30k and about 500 meters of elevation, which is what, like 1,500, 1,600 feet, I guess. Um, that was pretty tough. It wasn't, you know, but it's it was manageable. But that's also really near where I live. Like, that's literally where we go and do training runs is on that route. So it's all very familiar. Um, but yeah, Beachy Head is going to be... Beachy Head is like 1,000 meters of elevation, I think. So that's like 3,000 feet, 3,300 3, feet, I guess. Something like that. Of like difficult trails. It's going to be going to be a challenging one. But it seemed like a good time to do it because I've got London Marathon beginning of um, beginning of October, and then Beachy Head is end of October. So it's you know it's only one training block, right? Didn't really look around to see if there's any boys. Oh, which one shall I pick? I like the left one. I need a helmet. Yep. I'm trying to remember not to frag everyone. Scotland has freedom to roam, so you can go on private land as long as you act in a responsible manner. Nice. Yeah, I remember reading something or he hearing something about that at some stage. That is good. Oh, we want the QBZ, don't we? Ooh. We'll just run that instead of the ump, I guess. Cool. There we go. So it's not too bad. What's up, Slidey? How you doing? You should run up my driveway, three miles dirt, 2,000 feet of elevation. Oh my god. That's a, that a serious driveway. Pretty serious. Um, I mean, there's got to be a guy around, right? There's always someone here. Have I watched Where Dreams Go to Die? No, I don't think so. Friends. I'm just going to skim around the wall and we might, we can hopefully pick up a better helmet and um, we'll hear if there's someone like running around in one of these or like see an open door or something. Um, there we go. Look, this will get the QBZ done. The Doobler. I think we're alone now. No grenades. All right. Imagine if that killed someone. The dream. Parachute bag. Oh, another comp. Bit of luck. Um, well, we ain't seen nobody, so I guess we'll just go for a jog. We could pop the parachute bag. I think we'll just walk, to be honest. Probably more likely to bump into people. Let's take this red dot. Uh, oh, is that? Nope, that's not what we want. I'm going to stick with the 3x because I just find I don't do as well with the... I know the 6x gives you the zoom, but I just don't find I do as well with it. I need more, more training in the way of the 6x sprays. Let's get this boost and then we will go. And this stunt and then we will go. Well, it's a bit slower pace than dropping boot camp, isn't it? Some shots over there. I think we'll just follow this road till we bump into people. Have you thought about going single gun 
med bag. Um, I mean, not, not really yet, but we'll, we'll probably will do that at some stage. I guess at the moment, I've like I've not really been focusing on like one gun specifically at a time. I'm just generally trying to play games and use like one of the boat. Okay. Go on, park up, park up, park up. Just generally trying to level up stuff that I don't normally use. We got a tag on him there. Anybody? Like we might, you know, if we if we might occasionally have a day where we're like, let's see how much we can level up like this gun in one day it might be kind of fun. The med bag is gonna get nerfed, it's too good. Yeah, I think it will get nerfed. There was a moment where I was like, I'm not quite sure where that grenade ended up. He was very sneaky. He must have been on that rock or something. I just heard him creeping along behind me. Sneaky boy. Um, thank you. Thank you. Don't want your frag because we're not allowed to frag anyone. Ump QBZ. Very nice. So where are you? He died zone. We did the damage, so that's fine. I was just amazed how he didn't go down. Yeah, weapon mastery is... Um, I might go check that guy for first aids. The next zone's kind. Weapon mastery is basically all on, pretty much all on damage. The base score, anyway, is all on damage. And then the further you get through a game, you get like a big multiplier on it. So, even though that's kind of annoying to not get a kill, it doesn't really matter too much for the weapon mastery. It has an effect on it. But it's not too drastic. He didn't even have a level 3. I don't know where I was shooting that guy. He was hell of a tanky. Very tanky boy. It would be kind of fun to try and like focus on one... To have a day where I'm like, we're focusing on this gun. You know, you'd have to have games where maybe you couldn't find it, but it would be interesting to see how many levels you could get. Like, something that's really low. I mean, we'll definitely have to start doing that with, like, pistols and stuff, right? God, that's going to take me forever. I need to start okay, picking up the odd kill here and there. Particularly because, um, like, if we can just start using pistols more regularly and just get, you know, if I just get, like, one or two kills with a pistol in a game where I win... Then that'll get loads of XP for the pistol really easily. Whereas if I leave it till I'm trying to get games just using pistols, that's going to be a lot harder, right? Will pistols ever get done? Place your bets now. <laughs> How long can we leave a bet open in chat? There we go. Pistol. Got enough bullets for one, one or two random newbies. Just heard a guy driving over here. You shot him right in the bomb. Oh, hello, friends. Where are you going? Where are you off to? Oh, he beached his car. Right, okay. That's why he's jogging. I'm a coming. Giz! Oh, sorry, mate. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Hate to see it. Um, anything for me? A pan. Thanks, Giz. A little bit of ammo for my pistol as well. Oh, Giz. I know. <laughs> Feels bad. Uh, hey, McLovin. How you doing? You know the PC player numbers are low? Uh, that is not true. The PC player numbers are massive at the moment. Um, and it's they're massive on console as well. Yeah, the game went free to play about just over a month ago, um, and the player numbers are absolutely popping on, on both. 
Can you play one man squad and finish people with a pistol? No, because it's on damage, not not kills, so it doesn't won't do anything. Shame. Shame. Double QBZ. We don't really... What are we? Level 98, did we say with this? Something like that. Yeah, 98. We don't need much with this. If we can get to the end game with like four or five kills, we'll probably get it. Or reckon. You know, plus that damage we did on that blue boy. Damn blue boy. Damn blue boy. Ooh, there's a man off yonder. A little bit far for me. The QBZ spray, I would suggest. I'm coming. You don't get damage points for shooting a knocked person. No, I don't believe so. Let's see if we can find this lad. Oh, he's found himself a bike. Okay. You coming for the bridge? Panic! Panic! Don't panic! Oh man, I was just gonna stun him and pistol him. Oh, I shot in the back by UK postman. Oh, he's getting revenge for me killing him before. How dare you! It's so good seeing people rediscover PUBG. Yeah, absolutely. It's been great. So nice to see it popping off again. Such a great time to, you know, great great time for players, great time for content creators. Oh, wow, he's... He's moving. Wow, okay. Bold. I mean, you're not in the play zone. It's going up here. Okay. I saw you. Did he push up? I don't know where he went. I feel like he's in this building, but he could have run on. We'll be chilling on some of these rocks. We'll just keep an eye out for him for a sec. I kind of feel like he carried on running, but we'll see what happens. He's not shot me in the ass yet, so I guess if he did keep on running, he, he didn't do it to try and trap me. Okay, well, it seems pretty quiet. Over here, friend. Hmm. Uh, how's the next zone? Not too bad. We're going towards booty. Okay. Let's go and cross over here, I think. Badly needs a season pass. Yeah, I can't believe there's not one coming with this update. They really do need... Jesus, did you hear that? There's a train. <laughs> Someone snoozing on the tracks. Um... Yeah, this, the season passes are such a nice way for, like, new players to just get themselves a few, you know... Oh, my God, there's always someone fucking waiting for here. 
Get himself some gun skins. Get himself some, you know, wearables and stuff. For quite a reasonable price, rather than have to buy shit from the store. I don't know where this guy was sniping from, but they're not very good, so that's good. In other news, Zuma has had his cats taken off him. Oh, that's good. Was that the footballer who was videoed kicking his cat around? That is excellent. What a dick. The RSPCA took them. Excellent. Oh, hello, truck. Well, we're going into Booty. Back at Booty. I mean, not that I've been there this game. But I was here last game. It's kind of like being back, right? I haven't got that many kills. Three. Who the fuck is kicking cats? Ah, uh, some footballer. Not anymore, though. I thought I saw a guy, but I think it was the fence being a bit shimmery. There'll be a season pass before May, I think. I don't think we'll be waiting until May. That would be pretty crazy, I think. But, um, you know, PUBG have done crazy things before. <laughs> oh, I want to... No, I'm just going to get my head shot off if I sit there trying to spray that guy. All day. Yeah, March has been sort of mentioned a lot. I don't know whether that's just... I think I feel that's more of a rumor than a confirmed thing, but I find it hard to hard to believe it could go all the way until May. There's some people. I need to kill some more people. Oh, hello. Have we got any stuns? No. Oh, he got me in the head with a Tommy. GG's. Good little scrap. My dog's my dog destroys toy cats. I don't think that's the same thing. I'm not sure that's what he was accused of. Or what he did, rather. It was a video. I guess it's not accused, is it? The flying postman. It was a nice play. He was just running away a lot and then pulled off a great little <laughs> over the top. It was nice. He was running around, wasn't he? He was a running. Hell of a jump. Yeah, I didn't realize it was up there till he was leaping through the air. I wonder what our... Uh, we might have done a level on the uh, QBZ with that. Mm, no, not quite. Still 98. GG's posty. Boom. I saw someone say they maybe didn't do a season pass to line up with free-to-play launch because they were giving away bits of G-Coin and then no one would really buy any G-Coin for the season pass, which was an interesting theory. Uh, it's kind of, you know, it has some legs, but it's, I don't know why there's not one coming with 16.1, right? They've had, a, it's, you know, it's over a month since free-to-play launch. 
and there's nothing, not really been anything interesting in the store. They're just like, yeah, there's contraband crates. Buy them if you want. So yeah, just weird to not not have it. Like season passes are so good. Uh, hey Gantz, how you doing? Do I like the QBZ? Yeah, it's good fun. It's fun. It's good crack. The starter bundle is still so cheap and includes 500 G coin. If anyone still hasn't bought that, good tip. Top tip. One sixty nine, that is very cheap. That is very reasonable. Um oh I need to update Chief so he's got the um tier two Patreon jobby. Audio commands. Where are you, Chiefy? Thank you so much for your upgrade. Bosh, done, there you go. 169 what an absolute steal right we're back on um back on tago would we'll, i think we'll just see what we find and we'll just roll with that right there's lots of stuff to level up here anything out of crates is good on tago because there's so many airdrops plus the um the k2 and the um mk12 are both good ones to use maybe we should try just running the k2 as a primary and just try and have a good game with the k2 i don't really get on with it too well but if you get used to it right Opinions on the K2. I feel like it's really slow rate of fire. It just feels sluggish to me. Trez sluggish. According to this post, it's around March. Interesting. Okay. We'll go for a bit of Termini. The classic. We could have gone shipyard and try to find a QBZ. I'm looking forward to the uh, the MK12 going all maps. It's going to be pretty good, I think. That is going to be a good shout. Mix up the 5.56 DMRs a little bit. I've been enjoying the K dot, the K dot, the K2, a dot, or the K do, the K2, the K2 with a red dot or a 3x. Yeah, I've not really used it at all because I'm always like, oh, here's an M4 and that's just better. So that's the good thing about trying to go for the weapon mastery. Is it gets you out of that mindset, right? You're like, I'm not prioritizing picking up guns because they're better. I'm probably not pick prioritize picking them up, you know, because I need to level them. Because they're worse. <laughs> I want K2, please. M16 is useful. Okay. There's me K2. You got a thumb grip on anything? Nope. Okay. Hey, buddy. <laughs> GG's. Slow you up. Slow you up. Woo! Slow you up. Um, who's next for it? Are they old, the old seer? <laughs> couple of decent, well, he was shooting okay. A couple of crouchy, slightly wiggly boys, leany boys there. It definitely shows that they're not like, you know, the brandest of brand new players. Didn't work out for him. Where was this? That's what we want. She killed a M16 kill though. Um, cool. Thank you. Fresh helmet. I thought I shot him in the face, to be honest. An MK12. There we go. That's a nice loadout. We need a um, grip on the MK, right? Oh, hello. Hello. Hi. 
Caved his tits right in. Oh, mate. If ever someone's tits were caved in, it's that guy. What's up, DP Leo? How you doing? Great to see you. Graph, this has it going. I realized my sub ran out, but I'm now patron number 69. Nice. Nice. There's a bike there if we want it, which is great. Keep an eye out for the air. Oh, we're not in the zone. I think I might just hang around here rather than chase the airdrop. Because the airdrop's great, but um, I feel like if I drive all the way over there, um, I'm not going to bump into as many people. And we want to get kills, really. We want kills. In relation to level 100 guns, trying to do level 100s has made me realize some of the guns I never use are pretty good. Prime example, the Tommy. Yeah, I mean, I got killed by a Tommy gun last game, right? That's the grip we want. Perfect. They killed me stone dead. Yeah, Tommy's quite fun. You know, it has its moments. Cheeky pistol. Excellent. A little bit of ammo for it. And extended for it. Nice. All right. Let's go find people. Uh, hey, Minzy. How you doing? Have you carried a Larry today? I've not. We were um, focusing more on my gun masteries again, which has been uh, which has been fantastic. I do say so myself. It's been grand. Need any of this shit? No, we're good. Bandos, though. Thank you. Got to have a little Billy Bando. We're pretty set, aren't we? Um, I mean, maybe we'll just go to the play zone, see if we bump into anyone. I guess we can keep an eye out for the crate. doesn't hurt, does it? The armor's really nice. It's nice to have the old... We've got the broken bridges up here we can jump, right? It's nice to have the level 3 helmet. I guess the first plane has come already, right? It feels quite late for a, a plane one. I don't know. We had the explodey drop plane as well, didn't we? Oh, shit, the bed and then he missed it. We had the explodey drop plane, didn't we? So, oh, there's the normal plane. Okay, well, I mean, we're, we're in a line with this, so we might as well try and get it. So I guess there won't be a ton of people over here, and apart from whoever's driven here, because you wouldn't be able to stay in the plane that late. Oh, it's tempting. No, let's stick, let's stick with the goal. Let's stick with the plane. Get ourselves armor. If we find a P90, that's really useful as well, because that's got a lot of levels to go on it still. P90 we'd take. Woo. I don't know if I'd bother with the MG3 yet. It does have quite a few levels to go, but I think I'd rather do my K2 a little bit. We did get a few kills to the MG yesterday, though. Anyone around? There's the good one. Okay. Okay. I mean, someone might have been able to drop here, I guess. If you stayed in pretty late in the plane. Pretty quiet at the moment. So many crates. Look at it. It's so silly. Sometimes it doesn't drop quite so many, but this is, uh, this is the full English. This is the works. Uh, what was my org on? Org was high, wasn't it? 89. We should get the org done. Uh, that's the problem. I, I don't want to leave an MK. But I have already done it. Oh, that is a... You know... How focused on these goals are we? I'm just going to dump these helmets on the floor. I don't want someone else to take it and kill me with it. You could hide it in a bush. What else we got? See if there's a P90 around. Atex, thank you. Leveling can wait, take the AK, the MK. I've got an, an MK already. 
I've got a perfectly good MK on me. The new MK. Yeah, it is a, it, you know, it's a moral conundrum, isn't it? A moral quandary. Might take that stun, actually. And some more ammo. Was there a grip for the org? I ignored it. What was there? Yeah, it's a lot going on, isn't it? <laughs> so many. So many. Where is the grip? Oh, Jesus. I'm surprised no one else really tried it. Oh, there's another crate down. I don't even look in. What are you talking about, grip? Are you fucking with me? Oh, there's an, oh god, there's an orm there as well. I can't. I'm not leaving an orm. Sorry, not happening. I'll leave an MK. I can't leave an orm. Not on my watch. Oh, hello, friend. He got stunned for so long, but we fucked up our shots. He's going to get the med off nice and easy now. Deary me. Got ourselves in a pickle. Wish I had another three stuns. There we go. Got him in the second attempt. His blind wiggling was quite effective. Quite effective. I didn't mean to. I was reminding you still needed one. Ugh. Ugh. What's going on down here? Hang in there. Oh, he got, he got him. Did he go prone? No, he got him. Ooh. I guess we can... Are we in the zone still? Yeah. I mean, we can chill here and like... Just fire off orm shots like crazy, right? And then pick up another gun. What's up, Mr. Grunt? How you doing? Luckily, you bluffed being shit and he fell for it. Oh, it was a good bluff, wasn't it? I'm glad you noticed that. It was quite a high level play. I was hoping he'd go for that crate, but he isn't. Doesn't seem to go for it. I just want to someone's turn up so I can fire some orm shots and switch to a different gun. <laughs> cool. Well, we can get some. Um, oh, we should check him for a grip for the org, shouldn't we? Uh, see you later, Jacko. Have a great one, mate. All right, we're just going to push some shots. Um, a grip, thank you. He had an MK-12 and a barrel. Very nice. Where's my bike? Let's go for a drive. When stunned, the movement is like a bot. Can't predict. It was quite hard to hit him when, the, you know, they're giving the old wiggle wiggle like that. Quite erratic movement. Should have done better, though. Right. Well, you know, we just get some kills of the Org. We can have some fun with the Orm. Fire off the bullets like crazy. Uh, and once we use them, we can switch out to another gun that we need to level if we fire it all off. There were shots out this way. I'm not quite sure where. Orm extended quick draw back there. That's fine. We don't need it. This car was very conveniently... That was close. Conveniently rolling into cover there. Shame! Shame! Hey, 
buddy. GG's. <laughs> GG's, I guess. <laughs> uh. This car's gone away, isn't it? Slow you up. Um, thank you. Oh, he had some stuns for me. Lovely, jubbly. Where's your crate gone? I mean, I, I respect the bold push. It didn't work, but I still respect it. We don't really need anything, do we? Uber delivered. That man was overconfident. He was full of confidence. He was full of, full of confidence. Do I see a man over there? No. Um, okay, well, let's just, let's just drive around and look for people, I guess. Try and pick up a few more kills. We're getting towards that later game. If we can try and bump that. We've had a couple of late game ones, but we want to try and get up to like the 10, 12 more kills and then get to end game. And that's going to be real nice XP. Like, we can get the org up a few levels if we manage, you know, a few more kills. I guess what we really need, right, is just one... Oh, shit, I'm out of gas. Okay. Um, all right. Fine. Well, we're walking. That's where the old crates were. I was just kind of keeping it that because we can get... get a, I was going to get a fresh vest and stuff. It is quite a lot of 45s for my pistol. We'll drop a little bit of that. What we need is, um, where's this one coming down? We need like one fight with someone that just goes on for ages where they keep healing up, right? That's all we need. <laughs> just one fight where you shoot them a load and then they heal up and then you shoot them a load more and heal up because it does it by damage. Get like a thousand damage just fighting one person. Just let them heal it out. Even switch seats to get out the passenger side. He did, yeah. It didn't work out being the best option, really. He, um, he just got shot. We shot him real good. Yeah, I don't think the org's going to be too challenging one to level up. It was kind of funny that I'd level 100 at the AWM before I leveled 100, like, so many other guns. I do love using it. I guess also, like, it does such high damage, and you get bonuses for headshots, so if you're always landing headshots with it, We've had loads of wins with the AWM as well, right? Because it's such a powerful gun. So you get wins, you get headshots, it does big damage. Like, you're going to get good weapon XP for that. Right, okay. Uh, we're going to swing by the crates and get a fresh vest. And then we'll go down towards the bridge and find some players, I think. Hopefully. That's kind of my rough plan. We'll see what happens. There's a car parked up by the crates here. You still here? Buddy. He is over there. There is a there is a spare helmet here if um it didn't get taken. <gasps> I really want to get this guy now. I want a bit better cover to shoot from like this tree or something would be better. Oh. There we go. GG's. We've nearly fired off with the Ormam. I might switch it back, right? We can grab the, um, the Mook 12. 
Where did I leave my Mook 12? Um, and there was a fresh vest there that I'd probably dropped. Let's take that then. Fuck it. It's here. Oh, they took that fresh helmet. Oh, it was the last crate. That was where the Orm was, wasn't it? Yeah, good shout. How late is this zone? That's fine. Beautiful. There we go. I mean, we threw away a few Orm bullets there, but not too many. Matching gun skins. Ooh, not anymore. Is this got that's out of fuel. That's okay. I've got my bike up here. Are there any MK skins yet? Wasn't there there was a P90 skin you could unlock through something or other, but I never did it. It was like some little side mission I forgot to do. I don't know if it's still up. It was one of the new ones. I don't know if there is a um, MK12 skin or a K2 skin yet. It was a good shot. We got it in the end. We should have hit it earlier, really. There's my old bike, out of gas. Yeah, he was just, I don't know why he was peeking like that, it was, was crazy. Right, all the way. We're into the late game, so we'll get some decent XP for these few kills we got. We just need to try and get a few more. If we can just pick up a few, oh, that just suddenly appeared, didn't it? That's weird. If we can just get a few more of the org, then we might be able to get, um, well, no, we won't actually. I was thinking it was 98. That was a different gun, wasn't it? The org, oh, that's the QBZ. The org is like 89, so we won't get the org there yet. Hey. Ooh, God, that was a bit quick. Jesus. Oh, I haven't got many first aids. Oh, dear. That's silly. Well, it's good he started shooting because I was going to pull up there. Quite sure where he um he's kind of tucked in on the coast. Should we get a bit of higher ground maybe or near this compound? This will do. Cover for lots of different angles. Bit of ammo if we need it. Armor if we need it. You got the Mosin skin yesterday, pretty excited. Is that a, um, like one you can unlock through something? I guess I probably don't have a Mosin skin. Where's this guy? I gotta remember I don't have an AWM now. There he is. Ooh. Sounds nice with a suppressor, doesn't it? Very pleasing. From the hideout thing. Do your 10 tickets. Ah, right. Okay, nice. Nice. Come this way, please. I'm going to fucking push this guy. I don't want to sit here waiting charge after him. I don't think I got a tire. I'm trying to, trying to. This is where the people are going there and that's where I want to be. Where did you go? Aha, hello. Hey, he's looking at me. That was uh, pretty disgusting. Man, when, with the zoom, when you zoom that and then start tapping it quick. Ooh, felt pretty nice. It does sound a bit like you're shooting them with a staple, a staple gun or something. Hello. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> oh, that was pretty fun. 
Who is he shooting at? gonna go <laughs> oh ballsy we shouldn't have kept peeking that Shouldn't have kept peeking that. Staple gun should be a new melee weapon. Yeah, nice little game with the, um, what's it called? The MK, the MK12. Just got greedy at the end. The ego peak, yeah. I mean, he was ego peaking too. He was hurt. He was just standing there. We're both just having a bit of fun. Let's see how we did. That's probably a bit of XP, right? Good bit of damage in that game. More, more damage than you'd expect for those kills. We got 10,000 XP on the Orc. That's up to 90. K2 got a little bit there. Up to 25. MK is at 24. We're chipping away. Chipping away. Good XP that game. Can't complain. How can you be so accurate with a controller? I feel lucky if I hit something. Uh, I've just, you know, I've been playing the game for four years, right? The K2 is so weak, it's ridiculous. I don't think I even really shot anyone with it, did I? I well, I guess I got killed someone, but I don't really remember using it. We did 100 damage, one headshot. When was that? I don't know. Oh, I guess we dropped it for the org, didn't we? It's right at the start, must have been. Am I using some kind of special controller? Not really. I use a Power Ray Fusion 2, but the only difference is it's got a couple of paddles on the back. It doesn't really help with aiming at all. We go again. How's everyone doing today? I think it might be time to make a coffee. Four o'clock. Oh my God, time flies, doesn't it? I can go three hours. Three hours. Breaking the power rate controller. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, had, it's had better days. It has had better days. Goddamn shitty controller. Yeah, let me, let me go make a coffee. I'll be right back. Give me, give me a couple of minutes. We're back. We're back. <sighs> yeah, Power Ray controller. Apparently uh, cheaply made. I guess it's quite a cheap controller, so to be expected, I, I guess. But um, I've got in contact with their support. They asked my proof of purchase, so hopefully they'll replace it soon. And then I guess I'll use it for another six months and until it breaks again. How you doing, Leonidas? Lovely to see you, mate. Got myself some snacking cheese that Sean bought. Getting a lot of Tago this afternoon, aren't we? It's like Dairy Lee cheese string. Poor man's cheese string. Wow. Um, cheese. Out of interest, which part of the controller has broken? So, on the back of it, where the paddles go on, it's got this kind of black thing here that actually pops out. Um, and kind of where the paddles, like, go in, you can't really see, but there's like, a, they just have a, like a little bit of plastic that kind of holds it in place. 
But um, so it's just like two little plastic nubs that kind of hold your um, your paddle in. But um, they've snapped off on both the bottom and the top one. So like I did have my paddle on the bottom and a bit snapped off there. So it'd kind of just flop out. It doesn't hold it in properly. And so I moved it to and that was about two months ago. And then I moved it to the top slot and then that broke a couple of days ago. So um, the paddle kind of like limply falls out now. Other than that, it's been great. So if they just want to send me a new controller every six months, I don't really need a controller. I just need the, the bit on the back. It's only a little plastic bit. I just need them to just, like send me a big bag of those. That'll keep me going. I'm easily pleased. Stuffing my face with cheese. I was thinking about getting one, but I've already had to return two of their cheaper advanced controllers. Yeah, it's not not great. I know, there should be cakes. There are no cakes in the house. There's very little snacks whatsoever. Bullshit. Go palace. Frankly, it's bullshit. I lost. It kind of makes me think that it's not, un you know, it's something that will just happen again as well. Because it's not like it's a one bit of dodgy plastic that was a bit unlucky. It's, it's done it on two different, the exact same things happen on two paddle slots now. So it does just make me think it's going to keep happening again. If money was an issue, what controller would you get? Uh, I'd just buy another Elite. Because I had an Elite one, and that was that kept me going for a while. Money was no issue. I'd just buy an Elite and then replace it, like, every year. <laughs> hey, Twisty, how you doing? Okay, more guns. Did we get anything up to 100 today? We got something up to 100, didn't we? What was it? Oh, the MP5, I think we did. Oh, he's bouncing along like a crazy man. <laughs> I was trying to climb up that. He's gone ump. Ah, oh, that was a Tommy gun. So I just need to hit one fucking headshot on this dude. I love my power ray, but I've got the OG Fusion Pro. Yeah, I've got the uh, Fusion Pro 2 with the, the paddles is problematic. I bought the power ray enhanced and broke it on day one. <laughs> How did you manage that? Hey, Terminator. Uh, hey, Tom Dutay, how you doing? Sorry, I think I missed your message there. Back on Erangel, nice. We had two Erangels right at the start of the day and then we've been on, on Tago for basically the whole day. So nice to be back. I feel like controllers is like, it's like when you ask people's opinions on internet service providers. There'll always be, there's always gonna be someone there who's like, it's shit and always be someone there who's like, it's great. And they're about every single different one. So you can never, it's hard to, you can never really judge it on feedback from people. Because there'll be someone who's like, I've never had a problem with Elite. There'll be someone who say it's shit. They'll be say and exactly the same for Scuff, for Power A, you know, for Battle Beaver, whatever other, you know, controllers you can buy.
Uh, what's up, Cadge? How you doing? Love your content. Thanks very much. My power A is amazing. You should see my power A. Stop punching me. My shoes. Check out my power A. It just stopped working for no reason. Only 30 quid. Oh, wow. Oh, you just got one like the normal basic controllers. I've got loads of basic Xbox controllers, but not paddle ones. That's the thing. I really enjoyed my Elite one. It lasted me for a while. It got knackered by the end. Like the stick drift on it was really bad. And the RB or LB was a bit sticky. But I did use that controller for like two or three years. I wouldn't mind having another Elite sometime. They're just, they're about 150 quid to buy at the moment. It's a lot of money to spend on a fucking controller, you know. Yeah, the, the warranty is meant to be pretty good. This is a funny old plane. Maybe we'll just crate game it. They sell them at Argos 30 quid. Yeah, I don't... It has back buttons for 30 quid, but that was the one that you said it broke literally the first time you used it. So you're not really selling it to me. This was 75 with back paddles, which is good for, you know, if it works. Considering the other options with paddles that tend to be like, you know, the Elite and Scuff, which is like 150 quid, 200 quid. They are wireless though. This is wired. It's a bit of a problem. I'd rather have a wireless controller. Mmm, cheese burps. Oh, there's a lot of people going up here. Kind of surprising. Everyone going to apartments. Of course they are. They love apartments at the moment. Oh, I've got a fucking guy here. It's annoying because I don't want to commit to this because if there's no vehicle, then it's fucking sucks. So I'll shit the bed. Fuck, it's reloading. Elite controlled is the best, just awesome. You look after it. You mean elite controller? Well, I've had an elite controller, so I know exactly how they how they work. Uh, hey, Red Red Edge, how you doing? Invite all of the controller makers to send you their controller. It would be nice, wouldn't it? It would be nice. And then if they don't work, then I just slam them on the internet. Oh, back on Sani. Well, there we go. What's up, man? Muse, how you doing? Paradise. How's our... um? Controller Battle Royale. I'm, I'm gradually working my way through all the different types. How are we doing on the old guns then? Um, so QBZ is level 98. We can try and finish that off while we're here. QBZ and then whatever I think is a good shout for this game. We can run the QBZ as a primary with a 3x or, um, you know, as a, a, sorry, as a secondary with a 3x or as a primary. QBU, yeah. What's my QBU at? 64. QBU's got a lot a lot to go. I guess doing like map specific guns is normally a good shout, right? Because they're the ones that are gonna be harder to level up. On this map, M2496 X EMT. I do need to level the M249, but I'd rather have two guns that I need to level and then you're going to, you know, share the love a little bit, right? Run the Qs, QBZ, QBU. Run the old two Qs. Oh, I fixed my um my oven, by the way. I've added to my my DIY skill list by fixing my oven. The grill element was broken and broken my oven the other day. It just blew the fuses. The uh tripped the switch, I should say. And the element in the grill was broken. I ordered a new one online for 20 quid. Fitted it myself. 
and it works great. So I am now a an oven repair professional, uh, also a professional plumber after fixing that tap. Quite the wide range of skills that I've got going on now. What's up, Dogtown? How's it going? I was pretty pleased with that. A few years ago, I would have just phoned a man and be like, my oven's broken. Can you come and make my oven work, please? Here's some money. Here's my hard-earned cash. Fix my shit. Now I do it myself. I could start my own business fixing ovens. That is true, my muse. That is true. Cheers for all the subs and resubs today, by the way. 11 today. We had some lovely gifties earlier from Brian. 541 total subs is amazing. 83 patrons as well is absolutely incredible. Big shout out to all our Patreon supporters. You're all absolutely heroes. Nice one, Fire Rat. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Broken element is what it is 90% of the time. I mean, it was easy to know because it tripped this. I turned it on for a bit, the grill on for a bit, and then the power went. And when I turned the power back on and turned the grill on, like the fan came on for it, but the element didn't heat up. So, yeah, it's nice to repair it nice and cheap. Get a few more years out of it. All grown up. <laughs> Not many people here. Like two two dudes, maybe three if that high guy comes here. He's so high above me. He's so lovely. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back, come on. Go look for these boys. Preferably kill him with this because it needs leveling. Got a vest, right? Oh, yeah, we got that three. I believe it's so quiet here. Hey, Spooders, how you doing? Sneaky snakes. Why is there nobody at paradise? I hear a man. In here. Oh, he's, that, he's in this c corner here, I think. Oh. No, he's in the corner upstairs, then, I guess. He's in here. <laughs> right in the gut. Oh, okay, there we go. He didn't have any bullets, did he? Lol. I replaced the igniter on my grill recently. It was pretty chuffed. Oh, nice. That does sound satisfying. You're another man. What's he just picked up? He was close. You know, fucking jump backwards over this? Jesus. I think he's on this corner of the steps, I reckon. Or he's on the other side of this wall. <laughs> uh, hey, buddy. Hey, Tony! Hey, Tony! I mean, this, this gun is like level 98, right? So we could stick with this. That we'll take the QBZ and then hopefully find a 3x for that. We'll give this a go. Beautiful. Don't need quite so much of that. 
Yeah, nice. Get a choke would be good. Should there be one about? They should add a footsteps grenade to mess with people. I was going to add a, uh, a, like a footsteps command for our Patreon so they could trigger like the sound of footsteps, but I thought it might troll myself too much. I might get just it just get me killed so often. I'd I'd be fuming. Oh, I heard a guy. And that's without a troll command. Mutant needs some leveling. We had a good mutant game the other day, didn't we? That was a great one. What level is my crossbow? Oh, like 10, I think. I just, I never use the crossbow. Crossbow and pistols have got just so, so long to go. Take the 2x on that for the minute. Might do better than with the uh, the 4. We keep the 4 as an option. Ah, perfect. Cool, alright. Let's go find people. Um, oh, I guess we still wanted a choke, but it's not a huge deal. We just, because we've got the, the QBZ is going to be good for like mid range anyway, right? Let's have a quick glance around for a choke in case we get lucky. Oh, give me a lucky choke. This is a great loadout. Yeah, it's something, isn't it? It is something. Uh, a choke? No. Uh, okay, well, let's just wander through the zone and try and find people whilst drinking coffee. That's your next challenge game, crossbow pistol only. It's going to get, once I've got all the easy stuff done, there's going to be a lot of really hard stuff to use. I'm going to have to start trying to get a lot of pistol kills, a lot of crossbow kills. But for now, there's so many different options for what I can use, right? You've been having more success with the duck bill recently. Yeah, I don't mind which I have, to be fair. Duck bill is pretty decent. Drone usage too. Thankfully, the drone isn't um, doesn't need leveling. It could be handy for getting locating people with the cross to kill with a crossbow. I suppose that'd be very sneaky. That would mean you were just running a well. You could run a crossbow, a pistol. I suppose cross crossbow pistol and a and a drone. Ooh. That'd be something. I need to add medic stats for all our EMT heroes. Yeah, like revives and stuff. Team heals. Oh, there you go. There's the, the duck bill. I'm going to stick with the 3x on the QBZ. I think I'll do better than with a zoomed 6. Let's see we get on. Just going to kind of trot around and hope, hopefully bump into people. And not get shot in the ass by the sneaky snakes. Crossbow scorpion drone. Sorted. Great little loadout. Come on, there's always people around here, right? When have you ever been around here and there's been no people? I mean, really. Yeah, it's going to be a long process, the old, uh, you know, getting the old level 100s. I've only just started on it. Get everything to level 100. That'll take a year. 2023. Get every get a thousand kills and everything. There we go. Oh, there's a man. You looking this way? No. I think so. He's fists out. I'm sort of hope I'm hoping he runs past this compound. No, he's going in. Well, pretty good gun. Oh, look, his box is on the window ledge as well. <laughs> Hate to see it. Anyone else? It's only been a year since you started. Nice. I mean, you play quite a lot, right? 
you put in you put in some time. Think we'll catch anyone else like running in from this way. It might be worth chilling here, I think, with the play zone. Where it is before we move on. What's my most recently mastered weapon? Um, well, I finished off the MP5 today. That was on like 99, so we ticked that over earlier on. So that is there. I haven't. I mean, this only started on Monday that I started trying to get these masteries. So it's a very new, a new adventure. Um, and I haven't been so much focusing on the ones that are nearly done. I've been just kind of picking up anything from the list of stuff that needs XP on it. So it's you know just spreading the net wide and gradually creeping them up rather than being like I'm going to do this gun I'm going to do this gun or this type of gun crossbows level 10 I think something like that not high barely been used crossbow took me ages yeah I bet I mean, once it starts getting, like, less... So there's less things available. I thought I saw the crate for a sec, but I think it was the top of that tower. Once it starts getting to the situation where it's, like, pistols and crossbow and... Sawn off and stuff like that. Um, you know, it might be, uh... Pretty get to the stage where I run, like, a gun I've already leveled. And, and the crossbow, like, a good gun. You know, run an M4 and a crossbow and then... Whip out the crossbow for a couple of kills. Because then if, even if you win, as long as you, like, if you get a win or top five and a couple of kills, you get a pretty decent amount of XP for that. Is there a guy in that bush? There is, I think. Uh, no, maybe not. Kind of look like a couple of feet poking out the bottom. Well, okay, that's pretty quiet over here. We'll just go for a jog. Fridge got his 132nd... Crossbow dinner last night when we were in duos. Very nice. He loves his crossbow, doesn't he? Loves his crossy B. When you go after the crossbow medal. Yeah, I haven't tried... Medals is something I've never really looked at in this game. They're so hidden away, you can't... I kind of forget they're there. Well, this guy just... Got a C4 kill. GG's. You don't need as much to level up the snipers and crossbow. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, he's a, he's crossbow mad. He's a crossbow king. Danger Mouse, thank you very much for the six-month resub. Thank you, buddy. Thank you for your support today, everyone. Do appreciate it. We wouldn't be able to keep doing what we do without your support. If you'd like a totally free way to support the channel without spending any extra money... You can add our creator code, uh, which is very helpful. If you hit the exclamation mark code command in chat, you can go on there, add the beard guys under the creator appreciation tab, and then any time you ever buy any G-Coin in PUBG, they'll give us a cut. They'll give us a percent. Um, nearly a thousand people have added our creator code now. We've had a bunch more people add it since, um, since free-to-play launch. So massive thank you to everybody who has added it recently or... In, in days of yore. In days gone by. We were, we were on like 930 something. When it last updated. So we're really close to getting to a thousand people. So it'd be amazing to have a thousand people with our creator code. So if you've not done it yet. And you fancy doing it. Um, you know go have a little look. It doesn't cost a penny. Until you start buying loads of G-Coin. And then it kind of does. Well, we haven't seen anyone, have we? We've probably run past like 37 people hiding in bushes, but we haven't seen anyone. Been very quiet. There's only 23 alive. Jesus. Not going to get many kills this game. Everyone's dead already. No wonder it's quiet. Have a look at... <gasps> we found some life. 
Cheers, Tom. Cheers, Hollywood. Cheers, Hollywood. I'm coming. I'm coming. Say hello. Uh, my, oh no, the guy at the top is still there. I just glimpsed him. Nice. That thing is so stable, even at that range. It's kind of crazy. Okay, where we going it? Not even a comp. Comp on a vert. There's a guy with a QBU down in quarry that just got a kill. Forgot. It's been a while since I've done much, like... AR spraying with a 3x, particularly 5.56 ARs, like the M4, the SCAR, and the QBZ. Nasty guns with the 3x. Anyone up here? I need to get going to this zone. Your favorite gun? Hey, Rents. It does the business, doesn't it? We're going to go fists out. I think we are. It's a little way. Caught a couple of your vids the other day. Good stuff. Thanks very much. Cheers, Joe. Thanks, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a lovely day. Who's alive over there? That guy's... Oh, he's just chilling. Zone's moving pretty slow, but... Where that guy's gone? Has he just given up? I had a jammer pack, I suppose. Well, we'll uh, ice front, ice forward. See who we can find. Did a little bit of damage on that guy. It's 15.2 live now. Uh, yes. 16.1 is the next update, though. 15.2 has been out for a while, right? If they even did one. But yeah, next update is 16.1. It's on the test server now, on PC. Nice. Anyone charging in desperately from behind? Can't see him. Guy might have gone play zone, I guess. It looked like this guy had level three helmet, so I just want to go check. And we could do with a little bit of ammo. Guy proning here, I think. There we go. The guy here. Glad he went down in one. Well, the zones move quick, don't they? There's not much gap there. Okay, we'll run over this guy's body and see if there's a level three helmet and get her ass to the play zone. Quickly now. Oh, it was. Oh, P90 as well. Oh, no, not time. Not time. Shame. Would have been fun. Oh, that was a, probably a bad idea. Yep. <laughs> Definitely a bad idea. Level 3 helmet that you headshotted, yeah. 
Uh, I had what felt like a TBG game the other day. Was doing a crate game on Erangel running the MG3 6X Orm. Got 11 kills. Funny part was how few kills I had until late. I killed almost the whole of the top 10. Nice. Oh, that's always so satisfying. And I normally don't even notice unless I go back and like, when I go back and edit a game for YouTube or something, and then realize that you kill like all of the top 10 is just super, super satisfying. Uh, let's see what we did in that. We, I don't know. Uh, yeah, we got a few kills. We got fairly late game, so that'd be pretty decent XP, I think. Level 99 with the pumpy. Sadly, not uh, up to level 100. And 99 with the QBZ as well. Oh, it's a shame. If we managed to carry that game out, we might have got those both done. Would have been good. Still, good game. What's my FOV set at? Uh, I don't know. I, I'm not really in F FPP very often, so I guess it doesn't really matter too much. Oh, I wanted that guy's P90. We didn't get a chance. Would have been great. Another Sanok? Sure. Okay. Do you run into bots? I just started playing again. I see more bots than players. Um, no, I don't really see any bots in my games. You should only really see bots if you're playing the versus AI mode or the casual mode, which is 12 players versus 88 bots and versus AI is just one versus 99. Um, unless you play in like very quiet queues at weird times of day, quiet regions. If you're Oceana, you might see a lot of bots, but in EU, like my games don't really tend to have any bots. Maybe a handful in squads where it tries to make up the numbers or people quit out because they don't like the map. Like this, there's like loads of people quit out just now. Uh, Orin, how you doing? Any idea when the next update is for the M4 buff? Don't know. I imagine it'll go live for PC next Wednesday. I don't know if they'll do console on the same day. They might because they did the patch notes together. So it's either going to be next Wednesday or it's going to be the Wednesday after, I would say, for console. Then we'll have to have a little day of using the M4. I know I've level 100 it, but buffed M4. Oh my god, that's going to be nice, right? It's going to be juicy. It's already a great gun. You get about 20% bots from around 10.30pm UK time on EU servers. What, in solos? Yeah, I don't really tend to get any in solos in my, my games. I haven't seen... No, did they, they launch the car today? I haven't seen it yet. Oh, squads. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I don't really queue in squads, so couldn't really comment. Right, we're going to booty. Let's have a big game. Let's do it. Oh, I shouldn't have started shooting that guy when I was running in like that. Just hard to resist when you just see someone. You're like, I just want to shoot you. I immediately regretted that decision. <laughs> 90 players alive. That's how many people quit out. A lot of people don't like Sanok. I like it. I enjoy Sanok, but a lot of people quit out. Launch this afternoon, nice. Reasonable number of people here. Where are you landing? guy in there as well? Was that the same guy? I just think he was around here and I didn't even notice. Is 
There's a guy close, I'm not sure where. Near, I reckon. Yeah, he's in one of these rooms. Oh, hello. He's in there, but I can't get around to get... I don't want to go through the door. Oh, fuck it. Whatever, right? He's just behind the door. There we go. I don't know why the other guy didn't... Oh, yeah, there's a wall there. I thought the other guy would have an angle through the window. He's still up there? Hello? Oh, you're a oh, different guy. Did you get killed? Sure. You go. This guy's barreled a few lads, isn't he? He's up here in the yellow. Same lad as before. This guy. Having some fun with his barrel. Hit him nice. Nearly have ammo. Um, okay. What did this guy have? Bit of ammo for me, thank you very much. Just take the QBZ. Might be handy. Drop that. Take that. QBZ was like nearly leveled up, right? Do you need Xbox Live to play PUBG? Well you need Xbox you don't need Xbox Live Gold to play uh PUBG now, no. I want to get this scope. I don't know if that guy's repositioned or not, or if he's still chilling in over there. We're in the play zone. Does it just look like the fight last five Red Bulls? To be fair, I don't always find like the the car reveals aren't always the most exciting thing. It's not really interesting. Even prat like not practice preseason training is even not that interesting, right? Because. It doesn't usually mean anything. Everyone's like, ooh, this car seems fast. And if it, it doesn't really mean shit, does it? It's not really till you get to the first weekend and then you finally see them actually racing. And you're like, oh shit. Any people around or just old yellow boy? Old yellow. Probably hiding. Probably hiding, that is true. Let's take a little bit more ammo for the pistol. Might get a cheeky kill with it, you never know. Apart from tires, it looked the same. Yeah, that's the thing. How how different do they ever really look? It looks like a racing car. Um, we haven't got any kind of range here. So we could do with finding a 3x or something. Watch out for old yellow. Get better vet. Oh, hello. <laughs> Sir J. Spunk Spunction. Is that meant to be Spunkington? Sir J. Sp Sp Spunction, I think it said. <laughs> oh, GG's. GG's, J. Great name. Great name. Um, cool. 4x, sure. Sure. Ammo, sure. Alright, cool. Cracking gamer tag. Absolutely stellar.
I kind of prefer, I feel like Sir Jay Spunkington works better though, right? Just, you know, FYI, if you're looking to tweak that, Sir Jay Spunkington, the third. Anybody in here? Circle sh shunters us along. There was a shot over here a minute ago. Oh, that's kind of close. I can hear a guy running around. We go over there. Sniper is over there. The same yellow guy from before. We keep tagging him up. It's a guy down here, though, is the thing. I think he's underneath me down here. Hi you, I heard you. He might be up top actually. Or he's like right down underneath. God, it's so annoying trying to hear people with all these levels. The three vests in there that I didn't see. Is that this door he opened? I don't think so. Like, is he underneath? Where is this guy? Gotta be in here, right? There he is! There we go. Got there in the end. Jesus, I mean, he was fucking running around like Forrest Gump. I like the way that guy in the, uh, in the yellow that's like a good shot has just been hiding. <laughs> Hiding that entire time. He could have come out and tried to get involved in that fight. Just been hiding the whole time. Doesn't want to come out and peek. Just going to keep peeking a window. All day. All day long. Um. Yeah, but... God, do we need anything here? There's so much shit to look at. Right, let's go. We good for ammo? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, let's go this way. This is kind of more into the center of the zone, isn't it? This is where you need the footsteps command. Oh my god, can you imagine? I'd be fuming. Right, QBZ, come on. Let's get this up to level 100. Finish this off on a high. The QBZ. Got a lot of boost, haven't we? Whole lot of boosties. What are we on? Oh, six kills. Six kills is nice. Just need to convert that into, you know, late game position. Get the big points, me guns. Going over to quarry. Okay. I don't really mind the quarry. What? So they're going to change Sanok, they've said. They're taking out rotation, not in 16.1, which is the next update. But in 16.2, Sanok is being removed temporarily, and they're bringing Haven in, and they're gonna—they said they're gonna rework Sanok a bit. Did he just kill a guy? I think so. I felt like he just like shot a guy who was hurt, didn't he? Hey, buddy. 
Sounded like, yeah, the shot of someone who just poached a kill. Um, do, what do we need? SMG stuff? Stuns? Yeah. Be fine. Um, so, but yeah, so I, what would people like to see changed on Sanok when they change it is the, is the question, the question of the day. I, for me, ruins and docks are the two priorities. They're the two that I hate the most from the new, newish Sanok. I want old ruins back and I want old docks back. There's a guy. He's dead. He looked like a bit of a sweat as well, maybe. He had a pu he had purple outfit and a and a whiff of aggression. <laughs> that makes me think he was probably an experienced player. Not so many bushes. That would definitely be something people would enjoy. Absolutely. So that dude was running a DBS EMT. Oh, what, on those two, the pile that I killed? I didn't even clock that. It was all a blur. I take those bandos, actually. I just want to grab this smoke. Thank you. Hey, truck. We'll leave you to it. I think we're going to stick on the edge for now. There's been a few gunshots. Oh, there's... No, yep, yep, there's a man. I think he's got a bolty. He's been patient. He's probably a bolty. No. Space Coyote! GG's Coyote! You have any ammo for me? Nope, he's got a stun. Nice stun usage there, happy with that. Didn't stun myself either. This guy's pretty close. I think I just glimpsed him running down this hill. Well, there he is. Just a little late getting on there. Not good timing. Do you have anything for me? Eh, got a couple of stuns. Cool. Thanks. Ten kills. We haven't had many. Is this, I think it might be the first ten kill game of the day. We had a win earlier, didn't we? I can't remember how many we got in that. Nice to get a few more on the board. Oh, this zone's a little way. And it's a move in. Let's get double boosted. I think it's going to be a good shout for this. Looks like we outrun this pretty well. Nice. Come on. We got to get this one all the way. Win this one. Big XP for the ump and the QBZ. Get the QBZ up to 100. Bish bash bosh. Bob's your uncle. Fanny's your aunt. And my name's Ben. Welcome to the channel. Been a pretty clinical game so far, hasn't it? I mean, from what I can remember, I probably just blanked out any of the bad memories. Just got to remember the good times. QBZ must be there already. I'd expect so. It was on like 99, wasn't it? We'll run it all the way, though. 
you know, we're not going to switch out. Oh, there's a man. He tanked more hits than I thought he would after the heady. God, these freaking bushes. I hope they do tweak them a little bit. They're so easy to hide in. So, so easy to hide in. Hey Spoon, how you doing? Great to see you mate, Russell HC. How's it going? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope everyone's enjoying the stream today. Thank you so much for spending your time here. It's been a fun one. 12 left alive. Where are you all? Oh, there's a man. He's looked quite active. It's quite easy. Normally you can spot out the new players quite easily because they're so static, right? It's such a sign of like inexperience as being really static. Standing still, not moving much. Running around in straight lines. Gotta get over there. This is going to be nasty. We're going to go for this house and then move from there. This guy is going to be just on my right though. Where's this QBZ guy? There he is. Thankfully, he killed the guy that I was worried about, so... That's pretty handy. Made life a little easier. Don't see anyone there. Move through this. Eight alive. Looking good. Bro, oh, we're looking pretty good. It's busy up here. Another one. And unlike my normal games with lots of kills, I haven't killed anyone with a frag or a molly. Not a sausage. There's definitely someone up there because we just heard that fight a second ago. Six alive overall. Moving down onto this big compound here, which is going to be interesting. You sneaky snakes. Can you hire up and win this? I have a meeting starting in one minute. Oh, just, you can delay it for five, right? Oh, there's a man. He was so slow finding cover. I mean, it's all damage, though. I guess this is already level 100, basically, isn't it? So it doesn't really matter too much. I want the kill. I feel like there's someone behind him because there was a fight there. but That was him trying to shoot me. Oh, he's going in the compound now. Well... Anyone up here still? It's quite hard to full auto spray people like that sometimes because the recoil just pulls it up, doesn't it? Anyone else sneaky snaking? Wouldn't be surprised. Let's get out of the compound. I hate being there. I guess Jumpy just got killed by a man behind that rock. Three left alive. One is undoubtedly in this compound. A bit worried. I want to get this guy, but I need to watch my ass. I'm on... We haven't got much ammo left. The QBZ, have we? This guy's got to run down this hill, which is when we need to get him. Just a bit worried about getting shot on the side. There he comes. There we go, nice. 
We got enough ammo. There's only two people left. So there's the guy we nailed on that tree who moved down into the compound. I guess he's one that's in here somewhere. And then there's someone else somewhere. Probably chilling in there or he's sneaky snaking up top, I guess. Oh, I see one guy. This is the guy. Okay, yeah, I need to be careful. I don't have a level 3 helmet. <laughs> Just remembered that as I was like slow peeking this dude. Keep chipping away. If we can crack his helmet, that's helpful. Oh, that is, oh that's a decoy grenade. Thank fuck. I'm going to move in case that was like some... Yeah, I thought maybe someone threw a frag as well. Where's the other guy? On this wall or something? I don't know where that came from. I reckon it might come out of that door or this little wall here, maybe. I feel like they all know where I am. Where I was, I guess. Were you like, fuck! He didn't do much damage though. I thought he hurt me more. Well, this cover sucks. Nice! There we go. There we go. That's a good win. That's a good mastery win. QBZ level 100. Good points on the arm. Nice. Happy with that. Happy with that one. 17 kill dinner. That's good. That's good. Got to be happy with that, right? Ooh. Good hit points. Let's see how much XP we did with those guns. Fun game. Thank you for all the GGs. That will definitely get up on YouTube. Absolutely. Great game. Thanks very much. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. 1,800 damage. It's quite a lot for a solo game. Um, right, let's see what we did on our guns then. Career. Match history. We have mastered it because it said it there. Hide my, hide my face so you can see them all. 10,900 on the QBZ because we've got eight kills with that. A thousand damage with the QBZ. That's level 100. Done. Ump. We got 20,000 with the ump. Nine kills with the ump. 20,000 XP. That is nice. What level was that before this? 76. So that's gone up two levels. And we got a level on the vector as well, I think. No, half. Oh, well, we got, no, we didn't get a level. We got a bit of a level. Tiny bit of damage at the beginning. Nice. Good game. Good game. Nice. Well, that's a good stopping point. That's five o'clock. I think we'll leave it there. I'm going to go and um, go for a run, I think, while it's uh, quite nice and warm. Well, mild, I should say. Um, so I'll be back on Friday. Friday's going to be the next stream doing custom games. Then don't forget on this Saturday, I'm going to be streaming as well, playing PUBG all day, playing um, PUBG uh, squads with our Patreon supporters. So if you're a Patreon supporter and you want to come play some games with me, then come along on Saturday or you can sign up on Patreon and become a part of that. Go and check out the page uh, for some more information on that. But um, yeah, hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for all the subs. Shout out, shout out to all the patrons. Thanks to all the mods. Um, and thanks for hanging out. It's been a blast. I will see you all um, on Friday. What is a Patreon? Let me tell you in the outro.